Hi, hello and welcome back everyone. Hello and welcome back. How are you all doing today? Hopefully you're doing well. Oh my goodness, this game's amazing. I just realized this morning that I didn't even pour myself tea yesterday. I know. Insane. <laughs> hello, hello and welcome back. Hello and welcome back everyone. Oh my goodness. How's it going, Bradley? Thank you so much for the reset. Really appreciate it. Balnar, you too as well. Thank you so much for the reset. Really appreciate that. Hi, Rapicon. Bye, Rapicon. <laughs> Sleep well. <laughs> Do we want to wake up, Brian? You just uh, want to go to bed? All right, we'll try, try your best. Sleep well. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. And Paul, how are you doing? Hello, hello. All right, let's just jump right back in. It's going to be you soon. You're going to be heading off. Oh, that's right. Baby should be home soon. Yeah. Right around the corner for you. Let's so right on in. Oh, get ready. <laughs> get ready, Bradley. All right, blueprints found around the world are automatically added to your research table. Okay, so they're automatically added, but we still have them, like, physically. Oh, yeah, shark baits are useful for exploring reefs. We should take a look at that. Instead of just face tanking, like, two shark bites. Great. I mean, we can actually kind of fend ourselves off now, but, you know. We, we can fend it off, but... Probably best if we don't do it like that. Oh my goodness, we got a hype train going. Hype train? What? Amazing. All right, where were we? We were, ah, oh yes, we were harvesting. We need to harvest some new tools, and we're playing with this oxygen bottle. Play with this oxygen bottle. Um, let's go, let's still go ahead and have uh, this guy in here. I'm gonna, I want these both to melt at the same time, so I can do them at the same time here. I'm gonna have to remember all the buttons. So you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to bear with me here. To make sure that I'm not, not drinking salt water like we have been in the past. I think this kind of like clicked into my mind as to like how they have everything set up, but all the same. Planks. Alright, because we're really, really low on planks right now. That's why we stopped doing it, but let's just get back on that. It should be fine. There's some planks out here if things get, like, super dire. Uh, but our inventory is more or less empty. Uh, we have potatoes on the way. Oh, yeah, we can't make a scarecrow because we don't have planks, right? Yeah, we're missing two planks. We can make the nails and get the plastic. Alright, let's just go get the planks right now. We took out the shark. It's not, it's not like he's coming after us. We can just, just swim out here for a quick moment. Grab some uh, floating debris. Swing on back. Just so we make sure our potatoes are nice and protected. Uh, we need a little plastic. Okay. Scarecrow. Wedge it back in here again. There we go. Right back where it belongs. Those potatoes growing. Perfect. You off? I haven't lost uh, any more rafts, have you? <laughs> you can harvest a shark? Yeah, we can harvest a shark, uh, but we are actually leaving this shark here because I've taken everything but its head. So apparently that extends the respawn time. So we can, we can explore and harvest a little bit longer. Oh, he's busy trying to get himself back in game, right? Before Shark Jr. the 24th comes in and takes over. Okay, so it does look like our oxygen tank is working. I'm 100% sure. I, I think it's working. Goodness, we're going to have so much copper and so much iron. Or, I guess, just generic metal. Which, for all we know, might actually just be, like, aluminum. I do like how the air, uh, our air gauge, fills up in a way where it's, like, fast at the start and then slows down, right? You get, like, all the air you need, and then you kind of finish topping yourself off. That's pretty cool. Alright, what else we got? More scrap is good and all. Because we're just going to need a lot of nails, I imagine. 
Crap's still useful. We definitely want the clay and the sand. Don't know how often we're gonna need those bricks. But rah, this is the one we really want. We want a lot of metal. We're gonna need a lot of bolts. A lot, a lot of bolts. All right. Oxygen. Really nice having a lot more O2. And also this tool that just harvests faster. Oh, except for the whole food problem. Eh, that's kind of a thing. Well, we gotta back over to the raft here. Hold on a second. We're hungry. I wasn't paying attention. Harvesting's hard as uh, hungry work, you know? Metal up. Drop off that metal. Drop off this stuff as well. Working on metal. Where's our food box? There's our food box. Got enough planks in here. You know, we really should have done the shark work on here ahead of time. But we'll go ahead and we'll eat one pineapple to tide us over until you know dinner's ready. So we can get back to work. Come on. Finish filling the bar, please. There we go. Back to work. We don't need rocks. Rocks are not necessary. We, I, I don't know if there's anything else you can even use rocks for. I'll have to see if there's anything else we can find a use for with the rocks. I'm not sure if there's anything else we need them for. More oxygen over here. Scrap. I really like the music in this game. I upped the frequency a little bit. It seemed as though we were getting music once every morning, which was nice. But I like the music, so I want to listen to it a little bit more. So I put it on medium instead of long. So apparently you can choose how often the music goes. You can actually choose it so the music never ends. I don't know if we want to do music never ending, since I'm worried then we'd get tired of the soundtracks, right? So we'll let it we'll let it stop every now and then. I don't like how you can see all of the coming through the the moonlight, the shadows. Looks like that might be it. A little more over here. We are super hungry again. Doesn't seem to really slow us down too much underwater, which is nice. Keep going in semi-starving mode. We're just going to be super happy when we get back home. But it does seem like that's kind of it. Oh! Melon! Huge! Get that melon right here, right now. I don't remember that melon being here. I thought we scoured this place, too. Oh, pineapple. I wonder if they're respawning during the time that we're, we've been sitting on the island here. I wonder if they've respawned, or if I just completely missed it, which is also possible. Did you run out of planks? Oh, you did! Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. Those two, and we'll save that later. off the seeds, which we'll sort out another time. Sand and the like. Yeah, wood, wood right now, just wood and uh, palm fronds. Although we also do need a lot more seaweed, too. That's a real limited factor, limiting fast factor on the uh, tool upgrades. Especially if we're going to keep using fins. These fins are being blasted straight through. Oxygen bottle as well also requires them. It's going to become problematic. Yeah, I don't see any other metal or anything else for us to nab here. I am curious if there's anything in like the deep darkness here. Let's just like swim down for a quick moment. We've got a lot of oxygen. Is this just like the complete and utter abyss? Someone was mentioning you need to go down deeper for like better goodies. I see absolutely nothing down here. 
Okay, I see nothing. Maybe they were thinking we could get more metal down, but maybe not this far. Oh, jeez. Okay, I need to focus directly on just going straight up. <laughs> Cutting it a little close. Cutting it a little close. Alright, let's head back to the raft, and I think we shove off. I'm seeing nothing but rocks left here. And we desperately need more planks. And the sharks despawned, so... Probably time. Oh! <laughs> Speak of the devil. There he is. There he is. Alright. Play anchor. Let's get out of here. Holy jeez. Please don't... Just don't hit me with that thing. Okay, so we want to rotate the ship. Somehow. Because we're currently flying sideways. So, if we could... No, no. Oh, that's going to spin us backwards. Don't do that. So we hit that. We're going to we're gonna flip going entirely the backwards. It's not what we want to do. Maybe we have to spin all the way around because we're just on this side of the island. Let's see if we can do it. See if we can keep spinning. We don't have a paddle on hand. I don't even know if we can make one right now. I don't have the planks we need. Let's keep spinning. I mean, going backwards is probably just as good as going forwards, since we can just catch stuff from behind us. And we're not quite... I might have... I kind of overdid it. Okay, so then we'll try and... We'll go sideways, I guess, to the wind. Hello. Exact. We didn't exactly spin the right way, did we? Ideally, I'd like to go forward. Opposed to sideways. Almost spun around. I'll have to see how we can use the paddle to do that. But we're going to need to get our planks up first. Actually, is that enough? Almost. One plank off. Two ropes we need. And we're out in the open. There's nothing here. Looks like there's stuff way over there. I'll shoot that way. Kind of makes sense. We've already picked up everything on this side. Let's scoop this way. Try and get into the stream of debris. So we can get ourselves on track. Morning. Oh my goodness, look at the sunrise up there. On the east. So, oh, there's a, oh, hang on a second. Hang on a second. There's a boat over there. We need to go exactly the opposite direction of the wind. Oh no, exactly the direction of the wind. Push. Means our catchers aren't really going to be grabbing anything. That's okay. Hey, hey, you. Oh my goodness, it's already knocked off one arm. I do like that it, like, knocks it off in succession, so you know exactly, like, where you are in the process. More potatoes. We're just going to keep stockpiling potatoes. We're a good, a good stockpile of potatoes so far. Quite happy about it. Uh, we got some planks we can put in here. I'm kind of holding off make that paddle so we can go and orient ourselves properly. Alright, let's go see if we can get ourselves going in the right direction. Now that we're here, we kind of want to go that way, because now it's junk between us and where we're trying to go. Which is good. We need to collect as much as we can. And that, hopefully, will be the last plank we need to try and spin us around. I'm going to have to figure out how we... Hey! I'm going to have to figure out how we spin ourselves around here. How do we spin ourselves around like this? So, I 
if we rotate to go this direction, and then I like just like counter counter paddle. Does, does this does this even work? Oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> I've got a bottle taped to our face. Not sure how this works. I don't feel like I'm rotating us. I just feel like I'm pulling us the wrong direction. Maybe we can spin off of this thing. And use the paddle to spin off of that. Man, we can go a lot faster when we're paddling and using the wind. Very nice. We're gonna need to go and make a new spear in a moment here, though. Which I think is pretty expensive, right? Yeah, it's three things of metal. Quite expensive, in fact. Oh, don't let me don't let me lose this. We, have to, we overshot. Let's boot back this way a bit. Just go, go there. Yeah, we have to use the paddle. <laughs> good thing, good thing we made it. We need the paddle to get over there. Come on pull, pull. Okay. So if we, if we, we need a spin. So that this is over there. Let's spin. We try and catch ourselves here. So. Okay. Good. And then we spin ourselves back over that way. So we weren't quite in position to start spinning off it. We're going to try and use this guy here to, to spin off of. Because we want the front of the ship... Hey, you, go. What is it? We want the front of the ship going that way with a streamer. So we need to spin ourselves that way. So if we go... We need to go all the way in front of it. We need to be on the other side. Hold on. Hold on. It's all the way up here. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to remember how people were describing doing this yesterday. And now we go... Well, first things first. I don't think this is going to work. Second thing second, we can at least weigh anchor. Quite nice. Hop aboard. Those are only the crate, nothing else. Oh, what is that? Oh, so the moment we hop aboard, it starts to sink. I was under the impression it was the moment we took the item, it started to sink. Hey, well then, the more you know. The more you know. Darn. Oh, come on, Antier. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that in chat. Come on now. Alright. We got a decorative piece. We also got a hinge. Huge. Alright, what do we get? Decoration. It is oh, a fireplace. Whoa, sick. Okay. I can get behind that. Alright, so let's go ahead and go the way of the wind ish. I mean, I really want to go this way more. Let's go straight. Not really the right direction. No, get off! Yeah, that's all I was gonna break. It's unfortunate. Got up. Right, we can at least go ahead and make a new one. A bolt here.
keep holding shift. Okay. Keep holding shift out of habit from other games. Okay. I definitely want to get a bottle so that instead of using the cup. Or at least uh, drinking water so we can run around drinking water a little bit more easily. Rest. Let's go ahead. You. Perfect. Okay. Any spare on me? Not really. We just need, we just need planks. Drop that off. Right, we've got a hinge. I'm not too sure what I want to do with the hinge. I guess we'll just leave the hinge in our metal chest for now. All I know is there's nothing for us to collect out here. Oh, that's not good. That's very not good. We we kind of need to start collecting stuff, or else we're going to get in trouble. Uh, it looks like there's collectibles that way, but also the wrong way for the wind. I see a barrel over there. Goodness, parts of the ocean with no debris. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. Yes, so we're supposed to go this way. We want to go and follow the wind. Hey, you. Stop it. Hmm. Do some cooking. We can do some cooking real quick here. We have no planks, though. That's not enough to be able to actually cook this. We can't actually defend. If the shark attacks, that's, that's it. So we're, we're losing whatever it bites. Wait, there's a ray! Look at that! Where are you? I don't know if I can interact with these, these creatures. A crazy spot for a ray to be all the way out here. Alright, here we go. There's some goodies over there. I guess we'll just kind of get in the thick of them and try and run through a bunch. Run away. Oh my goodness, perfect. Come here. Just whipped it. Still hard to hit some of these. Some of the wood blanks. Just the orientation. We really need to get this. We need to get this spear going before we end up getting attacked. <laughs> Wait, is that a? Yeah, there's. Okay, yeah. When I look at, head at it, you can't. But if you look at it from the angle, there's a there's an island over there. Uh, we don't really have all of the materials we need to spend time on an island right now. As much as I would like to. Maybe we get towards the island and we kind of scoot around it and try and grab what we can. This I'm starting to collect stuff. Now I'll start working on getting that wood. Oh, come here. Thanks. Got food on the way, so we don't have to worry about that. It would be nice to go and get a fishing pole going though. The wind, the the water's getting a lot rougher here. The wind's still going the same direction. I think the wind always does, is what they said. I need a thing. Oh, <laughs> it's up and out of the water now. They're still catching some stuff. We're just inefficiently catching things. Oh, quick. I'm making a rope. Come on. Oh, wait. Oh my goodness. Seriously? You're so close. <laughs> I needed a few more seconds. You almost had it. Darn. 
You need to figure out how to spin the, the ship around. That's that's definitely something I need to learn. Gotta learn that. Fix that there. Like that. But you know, we can we can weigh anchor whenever we want. So there's not really much of a reason for us to not stop. Other than the fact that we're, like, low on wood. Something that really says that we can't stop here for a quick moment. Let's go ahead and rotate ourselves this way, though. Let's see. Actually, if we can use this rock here to kind of spin us on... We might manage to make the make the twist necessary. Done. The waves are a little choppy for this maneuver, but we'll see if this works. Oh, yes. Hey, oh, <laughs> oh <no. laughs> All right. Well, uh, mission moderately successful. We've managed to rotate ourselves 180 degrees. <laughs> not, not exactly. <laughs> okay, well, at least it's not worse. It's just about the same. <laughs> Mission failed successfully. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, darn. Let's go away, anchor. <laughs> I was gonna move over. Oh my goodness. Well, we gave we gave it a good old shot. Mo moderate success was found this day. Uh, the oh, what the chunk of metal. The wind was a a little too fierce. Let me get out of the water here. Whoop. Wow, I didn't manage to catch that the entire time I was spamming E. Goodness. Wow, we went all the way around? That was it? All the way. Okay. This is a very interesting little island. Oh, we have all the inventory space we need. We're gonna get a bunch of planks off of these guys. Whoop. Get what we can. And planks and bombs, all these other things we need. We need to look at potentially expanding the raft a little bit more. Again, we need to go deeper, make it longer. And then we can start looking at doing a second floor, front and back. That's kind of what we need to start looking at doing. Because with that extra space, we can then start putting down uh, some like larger plant growing. Thing, so we can go ahead and we can get the uh, the trees. Like the large crop plot, I think it was for uh, we can actually do trees. Which sounds awesome, because we could really use them. Growing trees on the raft would be huge. Just free wood while we're out and about. Free leaves. But if we end up hitting these areas where there's just nothing about, we we'll still at least get some to keep us Cooking our food and the like. What a crazy uh, rock structure here. Hey, there's actually treasure here. Nice. Food. I still got. Man, I don't have a lot of inventory space left, do I? Let's go ahead and let's use. Eat beet. Eat coconut. Zip. Oh, that's good. Well, that didn't work. Try it again. Right. Up. Flower. Not a pineapple. Yellow flower. Okay. Ooh, smoothie recipe. Bunch of rope and scrap, okay. 
Yeah, we're gonna have to start saving our coconuts and pineapples into life for these smoothies. Oh, jeez. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is that wreck. Parts of the wreck I found. What? Okay. You cannot harvest these out of water. Alright, you learn something new every day. Oh, big bag shark. Get out of the water. Go to the other side. I'll have to come around. Blanks. Nice with the water being calm. Whoa! Ow! Too calm. Some might say. What is down here? Just, just death and destruction. I don't want to jinx myself. I don't think you can get us down here. Don't make me do it. Okay, well, he definitely can get in there, so he definitely could get us down there. Now, if he'd be so kind as to stay stuck, that'd be... Hey, I said if you could be so kind as to get stuck down there. Okay, goodness. No. Goodness. Rude. Very aggressive today. the raft. Oh, that's not good. There we go. Oof, all right. Got plenty of planks. We can get that started. Let's get that metal rolling again. These smoothie recipes. I guess we'll stick with the other smoothie recipe. Oh, they stack. Oh, wait. This Is, is it the same recipe? It's the same recipe. <laughs> okay. There you go. Hey, you. No. Bad shark. Go away. Let's do this. Sort of. Now we're hungry. We knew we would be. That's why we had already prepped a big meal. Have some shark. Have a beat. Have some shark. Refill that. Mango, pineapple, and melons. Got plenty of veg and fruit now. Our potatoes are ready. Just three, infinite three potatoes. This is great. Let's see. I see how that works. Okay. Not exactly how I want to do it. Uh, seeds. Yeah, I want to get more plots so we can start really growing out some more of these. We got. Palm seeds, add water to get mango seeds, add water to get palm, melon, pineapple. Okay, so it looks like beets and potatoes just don't require water. They're just magical foods. Magical items. Require no such silly thing as water. Oh, also it looks like our slipper or flippers have broken. Unfortunate. Alright, what do we need for another one of these? More rope, thing of nails, a bunch more planks. Well, I literally just put a bunch of them in here, so. Wrap that bad boy up. Prepare this. Right. I'm not necessarily going to put it to 100. Or 5% is not quite enough. 10% maybe. Hmm. How's it going, Uncle Wood? How are you doing today? Yeah, you're going to need a bigger boat? Yeah, we're going to need a bigger boat. It's definitely something I want to work on. Uh, we do need more wood if we're going to do that, though. But I want to move this down four more spots. So one, two, three, and four down. And then maybe we move this section further down as well. But I want to go at least four more down. It's so what, one, two, three, four, five, six wide? 
Whoa, okay, so we, the, all right, the six by four, so we need 24 total blocks, right? If we're going to completely imitate this with this additional bit at the very end, by two, so we're gonna need 48 of each item. We have plenty of plastic to do that. It's not the not the planks. Planks are the issue. Uh, really, the only thing here that we want to get is seaweed. We have enough metal for right now. I think we're fine. We came here just for a quick pit stop, really. So head off that way. We want to kind of get ourselves heading in a direction that makes us just kind of go straight. Alright, there's some water. Drink. 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 A little salt water. Alright, now we're talking. Collecting everything here. We're gonna have to about face for this one. Quick! Quick! Hard to starboard! Hard to starboard! We're not missing these barrels. Oh no. Here you. Oh yeah. Oh man, this thing almost fell apart. I never really thought about that. We could also, like, since we're allowed to walk on these, we could actually make this in the center of the ship as opposed to putting it on, like, the front of the ship, like I currently have. We can encase them. Right? We could put, like, an extra layer around on the outside. Actually, we could put, um... We could put triangles. Hey! Hey! Hey, boy. Come on. I literally just repaired this. You literal demon. Um, yeah, we could use triangles to help, like, angle out the ship and also use it to buffer. We can't bite these things. That sounds actually like a really good idea to me. Let's, let's do literally that. There we go. Now the front of the ship is a nice little, uh, nice little head, like Arab head, as it should be. Nice. I don't know if we're gonna be covering the sides. The sides we might not do. Oop, come here, you. Oh, come here, you. No, you don't. Oh, no. I threw it short. Go so long! Oh, I'm not even close. Our direction here. Into our heading. And yeah, we're going perfectly perpendicular to the wind. Perfect. Exactly as we shouldn't be going. Excellent. Very good. It does let us still catch stuff, and that's all that really matters. Right now, we're just going to drift and acquire stuff. We just need to harvest right now. Okay. Let's go back to these. Start expanding foundations out. I need to get more wood here. I want to get a bigger. We'll get one more piece of wood on there, just so we have this fully rounded on the back, like this flattened down. We're in a perfect uh, pointing arrow currently. <laughs> Not exactly what we need to do, but yeah, it's fine. Um. We just need, we need to go and get ourselves properly oriented and get a lot of wood. A lot of wood. I don't know if that means we have to rely on swinging by islands more, or what. We definitely want more space. We've got to make this thing longer. Once this ship is a little longer... Oh, nice catch. 
Once the ship's a little bit longer, then we'll start putting a second floor on it. I think that's really going to help. Not like this second floor, but like a second floor where we can walk underneath. This rise here is good because then I can actually see where we're orienting, as opposed to trying to steer the ship like this. This is good. We can still put that, the mast, we can put it on the higher floor. At least get the barrel. Ideally get you two weeks if you need planks. Planks we're still short on. I'm not getting much of this stuff on this side. It is fine. Land our Yeah, no. Nice. Make sure we don't miss this guy, although I think we're yeah, we're running right at him. Alright, what is our plank count at? Only nine. Thanks. Three potatoes, though. Won't say no. We stacking them up. I have to start cooking that soon. We need to make smoothies. Though, oh, hang on a second. We can make binoculars. When did we unlock this? I guess when we used the empty bottle. Oh yeah, when we learned the empty bottle and then we used it to make the air, uh, our air bottle first. This guy here, oxygen bottle. Binoculars. Oh my goodness, binoculars actually sounds really good. If we can make a circuit board, we can make the receiver. If we can make a hammock with feathers. Circuit board, we can get a sprinkler. Water's crops automatically seems to be missing a battery, though. Oh, interesting. We can make, like, a little hydroponics room. Titanium ingot. Ooh, so heavy. Wait, what? Oh, okay, it's sarcastic. It's so heavy. Uh, we need that, and we can get the advanced collection ones. Contain more items than a sim. Okay, so I guess the difference is just how much it can hold on to. Not that bad. We keep grabbing stuff all the time. Uh, net canister used together with a net launcher. We need to get explosive powder for that. Hey, you. All right. We almost get more shark. We almost killed the shark. Got a lot of wounds. Oh my goodness! I should have gone for the full range. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I'm so good at this. Definitely getting better. Definitely getting better. Quickly. More potatoes. Honestly, if we had a handful of these crop lots, we could be just spamming so much potato. It'd be insane. I'm assuming it caps at five items in the in the collector. It just sounds I mean. We we peep, we humans we we like we like fives and tens we like those numbers so I'm just assuming that that's the case okay we got these two that we filled out right because we went to here and then it was out around here so we went three because it was gonna be what how long are we gonna do eight one two three four five six seven I can't be right was it from here yeah I must not have included that one. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're gonna do seven. Let's see how this looks. Right, any more wood first? Oh my goodness, come here. We haven't seen crates in a bit. Let's get some crates. Now, a rudder will be so huge. Wait, did I see a... Yeah, there's an island over there. It's got wood on it. Let's go over there. Alright. Rotate ourselves here. Hard to starboard. Alright. We're going perfectly in the way of the wind, so this will work out well. We should get there quickly. We're not going to be collecting much now, though. This is just not in the direction of our collectors. Maybe what we do is we have an inner line of collectors all the way around, right? Let's say we go out one more with our defensive layer on here, and we just put collectors all the way down on each side. And so we just have an inner layer, a one layer in of these collectors. Be useful. Here we go. So now we've got the defense of the angles. 
I'll go ahead and we can fan out the wing all the way here. Both of these. Like so. Go back to this. Hungry again. Our star makes us some spare food. We're gonna need to actually have a like have some pre-cooked food on hand more. I'm not keeping a lot of pre-cooked food on us. Uh, let's try and keep our fruits or smoothies for a bit here. Yeah? Let's start going through our spuds. We got a lot of these suckers. No, don't you dare. Get off that. Close. Oh, no. Where's the barrel? Come here, you. Don't you leave me with that. Ooh, a package. Nice. Yeah. We got a brand new paper bundle. Nice. Yeah, so we are still passively collecting some stuff, but just not nearly as much as I'd like to. Uh, is this seawater? What is this? Yeah, so. Let's drink up. Yep. Yep. Let's drink all the way up. Grab that in a minute. Our water sorted first before we eat. I know, we're tired. We're hungry. Don't worry. We're fine. I didn't even notice we got so close to the island. <laughs> Whoops, hold on a second. Alright, backwards. We'll go backwards now. And as close as we can. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. I think I do want to do that. We'll just start getting collectors along the sides. So unfortunately, we have a real wood shortage. Hey. Oh. Wait. Wait, anchor. Heads left. Okay, we got four pieces, four pieces. Anchor up. Huge. Let's go ahead and just put this real quick. Save you for later. Save this butts for later. Yeah, gets back that way. Perfect. This metal in here. Rocks dropped off. There's so many stones. I don't know what to do with them. We'll find something, I'm sure. I'm sure there'll be something we can use them for. Are we making no forward progress here? Oh, because we're literally fighting the wind. Making no progress. Actually, we are losing. We'll just have to do this the old-fashioned way. Get the good old paddle out. Here we go. We can get a little closer here. We can go ahead and weigh anchor. And the shark's down right now, so this gives us a good opportunity to go and harvest everything we can. Oh, how's that keep happening? I'm not moving. My hand's off of the WASD. It must just be we're getting inched forward slowly because of the rocking of the waves. Or maybe it, uh, it tips us too much and we get, like, knocked off because we get tipped over too much. Maybe that's what's going on. Okay, weigh anchor. Perfect. All right. What's our inventory? Inventory's okay. I'll drop off this. Because our inventory's going to be too full. There's an inventory. Make sure we're still cooking our metal. I guess we'll come back to that food in a moment. Okay. Grab what we can. Just need to go kind of crazy with collecting. This uh, shark is out right now. That was our chance. Gotta love the rain underwater. <laughs> it's 
Oh my goodness, it's raining so much, it's actually drowning the ocean. That's insane. Yeah, so I think I, I think I know what we're gonna do uh, with the ship's design. Oh, it broke. Awkward. But yeah, I think I know what we're gonna do with the ship's design. Then an idea. We need a rope and a bolt. Okay. Uh, we need not half. One. A boat. And did I drop off both of these? Also, is there any nearby? Oh, what's that? Oh, there's another island over there. Okay, so we might just go straight from this island to the other one. Carry a couple of spare ones on hand, spare ropes. Never hurts to have spare rope. We're gonna use it eventually. We might as well have that on hand. I don't know what kind of advantage you can get by using the giant clams, so we're just gonna. Eh, I think they stack. If they stack, we'll keep it. If they don't stack, we'll drop it. Yeah. Okay. I'm. I'm quite excited. With we're gonna. We're gonna start doing a lot of focus on. Expanding the raft to its full potential. At least, at the very least, we're going to expand its sides. So we've got the front designed how we want it to be done. We just need to finish getting the footprint, really, is what we need to do. So if we can finish getting its footprints, then we can start moving to the second floor. But I don't know how big we want it to get long term, right? That's going to be the big one here. I'm worried that if we get the raft to be too big, it'll be cumbersome and it'll get in the way of some of the maneuvers we're going to need to do. So I don't know how much longer we want it to be. I don't think I want it to get any wider than it currently is. I think I'm happy with how wide it is. Otherwise, we could do one more wide. It's not hard to build it and have it look nice doing it that way. It would let us have a center to it, as opposed to it currently being even across the board, which of course makes it look a little, it's a little harder to get the design to look nice and pretty. Oh, a crate. Oh my goodness, another smoothie recipe. Probably the same smoothie recipe, honestly. I'm gonna get some food in this. We've got three things of shark being cooked right now. Let's head back over. Go eat up. Ooh, looks like we've got a mango tree up there. Nice. I have to wave in. Ooh, we like swimming more. We're faster when we swim. <laughs> when, we're, when we're walking, when we're hungry. We're thirsty, really. Yeah, let's take a good look at this. Well, yeah, because once we're done with this, we'll be going actually too wider on both sides. So th this is definitely wide enough. We're going to go too wide on each side. So it's going to be four wider than it currently is. That should be fine. Yeah, no, that should be good. No issues with that. We also got some another decorative item. Two. Decorative item should we get? Got a stack of papers last time. We got a table! Nice! We finally know how to make a table. Not like we had one, but you know. Good. Wool and leather. Honeycomb and eggs. Healing salve. Good healing salve. Interesting. Well, there's actually not much more for us to learn looking at this. There's still stuff to learn, but there's not much. Pretty caught up. Hey. Yeah, so it looks like this is the same, same smoothie recipe. It's all the same. I don't know what to do with the spare ones. We'll just keep stacking them. It's fine. Go ahead and drink up. Get our vitals all the way up here before we go back out there swimming. One. Two. Three. Yeah, interestingly enough, there's not, there isn't a rudder or anything that I saw in here. Paintbrush, collection pieces, a grass plot. Add water, get grass, feed animals. Hey, all right. <laughs> How's it going, Babe Lincoln? Thanks for the follow. Welcome. Good to have you here. 
kind of salves a backpack. That sounds quite useful. Aside from being beautiful, it expands your inventory. That's great. Protects your precious brain. Ooh, very important. Other body armor, other gloves. Hmm. Yeah, there isn't a rudder or anything, so I we gotta figure out how to spin. We gotta figure out how to spin the ship around. I'm assuming if we have the wind going one way and I'm paddling the other way, we can try and spin it, but I, I just don't know. Take these planks. And you just need to keep getting as, we just, as much metal as we can. It's so much more important than copper. We've already got six copper ingots that are fine on, but that metal is very, very important. The more metal we get, the better. Okay, these clams, do they stack? They do. All right, we'll keep grabbing clams then. It's fine. Here, potatoes. Really spare. Let's just do around the potatoes. Planks. Get a full round of potatoes here. All right, back in the drink we go. Ah, dang it. Nibbles Jr. is back. So does Nibbles just stick around the, the raft? It seems to be. Not necessarily, like, honed in on us specifically. I mean, is coming our direction. But it seems to be more focused on the raft than us. At least staying within the vicinity of it. Hey. No. Bad nibbles, bad. Alright, jump up here and let's grab some of this wood. We want to swap over to a wood axe, or a stone axe once we. Stone? A metal axe, once we're done with this stone axe. Goodness, where it's. Oh, yeah, look at our beautiful arrow. <laughs> so I think we're going to go that far out right now, and we're going to go two more wide on both. So this is going to be quite wide of a platform. We're not going to be building anything on this outer little bit here. So that outer bit's just going to be a protective shell for the inner piece. The anchor we're going to push all the way to the back so we can have more open space in the center. I'm thinking we raise the front. Or actually, maybe we, we round out the front. Or maybe we wall off the front. Maybe, can we make windows? Yeah, we can. Hmm. Okay, so I'm thinking if we make, we can make windows and just have this whole front section be a cabin, and I'll block it off, and then all you have to do is run around the outside of the ship. I don't know if I like that. Oh, well, that's broken. Let's make a new one. A new scarecrow over there. I'm not too sure exactly how we want to build the, the actual building part. How do we get up here? Uh, nope, no go. Can we mountain goat up? Oh my goodness, we can. Wild! My, I just have to be persistent. Rock climber over here. Can you just grab these off now? You have to whack them. Give me the mango. Ah, dang, that was actually, I was, I was hoping we were going to be able to get this one too here. Okay. In which case, we're going to have to make a new axe. Finally time for us to make a metal one. Exciting. Uh, no new stack size here. Food, scarecrow, nails, a little bit more plastic. Here we go. Right back where he belongs, because I want to move the plots. That's kind of the thought, is moving things around so we can get a, a better setup for the plots. Okay, go ahead and eat this guy. Keep it stuffed off. Drop off these seeds. Metal rolling. Go. 
And then now what do we need for our axe? Oh my goodness. Hello and welcome, Raiders. Hello and welcome. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate that. Yo, Kiana. Welcome. Were you playing Raft today or were you playing something else? What were you playing? What do you play on your stream? And a very important question I often have for a lot of people is, what is your after stream snack? What's your go-to snack after you finish streaming? Yukina, gotcha, thank you. Appreciate you for uh, clearing me up on that one. You're playing Raft with friends? Excellent. But Yukina, what is your go-to snack after streaming? Streaming is hungry work. Yeah, okay, this is good. So yeah, he goes for this instead of instead of uh, our our collectors. This is good. We like this. Excellent, excellent. Perfect. Hey, everyone. Welcome. Hello, hello. How are you doing today? You don't have an after stream snack, but if you had to pick, maybe Honey Nut Cheerios. Oh, there we go. That's a good pick. Something sweet. Something with some good little carbs in there. Thank you for the follow, I appreciate that. Alright, so... I kind of have a plan on what we're going to do. Let's go finish getting the last bit of the wood off of this, which apparently we can just mount and go to. That's how it works. Up we go. It's a steep cliff! Not for me, it isn't. Hold on, we did it before. Come on, there we go. Not for me, it isn't. All right, so we got a metal axe now. All right, it seems to just be it swings faster. It doesn't seem to give us more material. A little disappointing, but understandable. It's not like the tree suddenly gives more. It's just usually it's um, the the logic behind it is upgrading tools creates less waste. You're able to extract more of the resource you want, and thus that's how you get quote unquote more of it. So we need to go grab a bunch of seaweed before we get out of here. More metal and the like wouldn't hurt. Never hurts to get more scrap and whatnot too. But we should do that. Oh. No. Uh, make some shark bait. Oh yeah, we were talking. I was talking about that earlier at the start of the stream. That I should make some shark bait and play with that. I've not played with shark bait before. I don't know exactly how it works. Put it right beside the raft and stab Bruce when it comes to eat the bait. Oh, interesting. So instead of baiting him to distract him, you're baiting him to literally bait him in for death. For true murder. For a hunt beyond hunts. I need to get a bunch of seaweed here. Now, you monster. Come here, mister. I'm gonna put you in your place. Oh, look at that! Sidestep, it's so good. Unfortunately, Nibbles here is worse than the minute. Oh, that's right, you have to go left, not right on the sidestep. I gotta be careful or else I'll die. Nibbles? I don't know where Nibbles went. Quickly retreat! I don't know where he went. There he is. Nibbles. Love your deep voice. Thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, it's not something I earned or anything. It's just something I have. But I appreciate you saying so. Alright. Let us drop off the... Oh, this, that's not the seed chest. What am I doing? Drop these things off. Let's empty up our inventory a little. You want, that's some seaweed. We should even have a seaweed spot in our chest. Put it over here. Our bottle is almost broken. There's no way to repair things, correct? As soon as something breaks, it's just broken. And that's that. We only need a mackerel and a pomfret. Pom pomfret? I'm not sure how you... I don't know how you pronounce that one. Pomfret sounds French. Let's see here. So, if we go and get ourselves a fishing rod... We wanted to make one of these for a while. Need a bolt. Easy. Done. Alright. 
Have you been to the first island yet? Uh, I've been to islands yet, but I don't know what you mean by first island. So I'm going to assume the answer is no. Real? Yeah, we need to repair a little bit of the ramp down here. Here it is. All right. Was this just faster? Did we get better fish? How does this, or is it just more durable? It might just be more stu it's more durable. I said. Come on, little fishy. All right, that's one. Was it a mackerel? Was the other one? No. Hey. No. We get three hits on now. We'll repair that in a minute. this bait. Man, the music in this game is just so good. I keep saying it, but I just, I really like this music. It's so relaxing. Was it the macro that we needed? That's the herring. I see, we must distract him with the, with the blue herring. Yes. When you get to bigger islands, there will be a house where you can trade stuff. Holy jeez. Okay. Uh, can you keep spoilers on the low end from there? I don't, I don't know anything about this game. I'm completely brand new. There was a big island, and there was a big, uh, there was a big, like, predator bird that was floating around while we were trying to kill, like, a little chicken bird. And I, I dipped out because we were running out of material to keep us alive. And I haven't been back there since. Right now we're kind of aimlessly scooting around in the ocean, kind of building things up. We'll figure out everything else in a bit here. We have the material we need to go and up a candle bottle. What? Is that just like a light source? That's gonna be cool. I cannot wait to start decorating. It's gonna be so nice. We've gained like a fireplace, table, chairs, a sofa. Okay, I just can't get a herring. Okay, here's a question. So, is there a way to determine what types of fish you're going to get? Or is it just always random? Is it like a full cast has a higher chance of giving you bigger fish? A short cast gives you a chance for smaller fish? Uh, fishing on the shallow side? Oh my goodness, it's salmon. Fishing in the shallows here has a higher chance of getting you baby fish versus big fish? Oh, I need to get some water. Or is just fishing random? I think it's random. What? I don't know. Get ourselves some water here. Water. Okay. There we go. Nice. Okay. Right. Keep rolling. Right. right back at it. Mackerel, we used to... Or herrings. We used to have a bunch of herrings when we first started. Maybe the fishing rod affects what it is. Because I'd never gotten a salmon before. It was entirely possible. I just realized I still have not poured my tea and it's been an hour into stream. <laughs> it's going to be some really strong tea. This game is so good, I just don't even remember to pour myself tea. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe it. We'll go do it. There's our herring. I'll do it in a moment. We'll just kind of finish up. It can't get any worse than it already is, right? Gonna fish and fish and fish. Let's go and let's start offloading some of this in here. Can we preview some? Not very bright, but a pretty one. Yeah, let's check this. Oh, I can't put that on anything. I can't. Interesting. All right, I can't put it on like tables. I can't put it on chests. That's okay. We can put it right here. There we go. Cute little light. Potatoes in there. Potatoes. Uh, okay, so the herring and the rope. A rope. Hold on. Okay, so we now have a bait. Perfect. Right on track with the fishing poles, mate. Oh, really? Okay. So it comes down to fishing poles. 
Alright, so let's go ahead and let's get some stuff pre-cooked here. What I need. Cook. We're gonna have to shove off in a moment here. We don't have the wood we need to keep this up. Uh, the mackerel we'll hold on to. Want the mackerel. I will hold on to actually you are going to be different. We're gonna put you in here because we can use you for bait. We'll actually save you specifically for bait. Save the salmon. And let's go ahead and cook you. I don't think I can cook you and the catfish at the same time yet. They don't fit at the same time. That's okay. Hey! I caught you. That's okay. We can go ahead and we can get you and some potatoes going at the same time. A more well-balanced diet, anyway. You know, meat and potatoes? Mmm. Delicious. We are going to need to go and get some more wood. I wanted to go get more seaweed before we left, but that's okay. We'll always get more seaweed at the next island. There's an island across the way, I think there was. Might not be able to see it right now at night, but during daytime we'll be able to see it. We're going to need that if we want to make the binoculars. Tilapia, very nice. Waiting on these potatoes. Can I just fish backwards? <laughs> yeah, I can. All right, so we can just keep an eye on our on our food. Oh my goodness, big potatoes! Come on, fish. Oh, don't do that. Fuck those potatoes. Jump. Keep on with these. Keep on fishing. Fish the night away. We'll, we'll shove off in the morning. Yeah, we need to go and get ourselves a bunch of wood. Actually, question. Does anyone know how you can rotate your ship? I need, I need to reorient the ship. And there's not, like... There isn't, like, a, um, a rudder or anything I can use to fix our orientation. Does anyone know how we can fix the orientation of the ship? I'm, try I'm trying to use, like, islands to spin us around, and we were moderately successful. We spun around. Unfortunately, we spun around 180 degrees in the span of half a second. So there wasn't much control there. I'm hoping there's a better way to do it. I kind of want to just, like, use this entire fishing rod. I'm, like, tempted to just burn the whole thing. This doesn't go bad in your inventory. It just takes up space. Which, we have inventory space here. We just dump fish in here. Like that. It's morning, so we need to head up and out. So if we, we could just leave all of our fish in here for now. They don't decay. If only potatoes gave us more food. It, potatoes deserve to give us more food. Potatoes are amazing. I love potatoes. I always go wild for potatoes in every game we play. Alright. Perfect. Done. Let's shove off. There's still stuff we can harvest here. Metals and the like. But wood is an issue. We're down to no wood. We've harvested everything here. Hmm. Yeah, and there, where's that other island? we will see it. I think it's over there. I feel confident. Hey! It's almost broken this thing in half already. Rotate back around. We'll go that way. More or less against the wind, as per usual. Cut off. Alright. Yeah, so we just need to get a bunch of wood. Wood's our main limited resource right now. It was palm leaves for a moment. Our palm fronds were low to start with, but... Doing okay now. Just tempted to go straight. You just need to collect more material. 
the sooner we get the wood, the sooner we can outfit the ship to be able to collect no matter what direction we're going, no matter what orientation. And the sooner we actually can build the second floor, which I'm super excited to do. Here are these. I'm also going to have to figure out how upgrading foundations work. Definitely something's going to need to be figured out. Hello, you missed an hour? Yeah, you missed an hour, but luckily you didn't miss too much. We've put an arrow shape on our arrowhead ship. And my goodness, it does... Does Nibbles love this corner or what to bite on? It's constantly teething. Later in the game, there is a runner, but for now, you're kind of stuck with whatever the wind <laughs> sail takes us. Unless you grind against an island to flip around. Okay, good to know there's, an, uh, there's something to do that later on, just we're kind of hosed for the moment. Excellent, thank you. Okay, so right now the big things we need is we need palm leaves and we need wood. And that's kind of all we need. I mean, granted, we do need plastic. Plastic's important. We need plastic so we can go ahead and expand. But the most important stuff right now is the wood. All these planks. We need planks and fronds. Or palm leaves. We just need to make a bunch of rope. We're just going to keep on building these suckers along the side here. We're going to take this all the way down. Essentially, we're just going to be taking these all the way down. So that then, regardless of the orientation, we're good to go. We'll do that on both sides. And then once we get that all the way down here and we flatten this off, we'll then create behind that flattened piece the alcove for this bad boy. I'm tempted to make our ship odd instead of even. I'm really tempted to make it odd instead of even. Classic's important for the environment. True, yeah, you gotta pull that all out, huh? I'm really tempted to make this an odd and oriented ship instead of an even one. Holy jeez, that's a big... All right, we found the big island. Not exactly what I was looking for. I mean, that's a bunch of trees, so I think I guess that is mission accomplished, huh? Get off that way. Slightly to starboard here. I miss that piece. Eat that. Yeah, we're gonna square this off here. It's fronds. Grab that guy too. Come here, you. Yeah, so I guess we're going to we'll explore. Hey! Off that. She hurt my potatoes. Yeah, let's go try and explore this island here. Mostly, I'm excited about is getting all the wood that we can. Although, I don't think those are harvestable trees. I'm just assuming they're not. Oh my goodness. We're, these decorative packages are amazing. I love these. We learned how to make cutlery. Huge. Oh my goodness. Big. And a painting. Oh my goodness. We're cultured. <laughs> we know how to paint. Alright. Uh, it looks like best would be trying to land over here. Move over to port. Side. Pop off that spare potato. All right, we're going to stop doing metal production for a quick moment here. We got enough and we need these planks for other things. I can't keep just burning all of it. I mean, I can, but I feel like we need it for progress. We're going to make it easier for us to collect everything as we go along. We're going to need to stop burning through it. Just spare plastic. This is quite nice. 
Yeah, we'll get like a, a proper chest room in the length down the line too. Spare nail on hand. I've been making nails, I don't need to. We've got plenty. Alright, let's go ahead and weigh the anchor. Waste it when we leave. Alright. Check this place. Actually, before we do, let's do a food run first. What do we want to do? Potatoes? What are we feeling? Let's go with some fish. We got some catfish. We got a catfish. That catfish gone. So we'll have one full catfish when we're back. We can get back here. We'll have catfish. All right. Let's see if we can go and harvest some wood here. What we need? Oh no! Absolute mongoloid. Go away. Ah, for goodness sakes. Well, it's doing its job. It's defending. No, it's, it's doing its job. Ugh. At least it's just the wood part. Just the main foundation. We, we aren't losing the nets. Alright. Can I cut this down? No, I can't. I knew it. They just looked like they wouldn't be ones I can cut. Oh, that's really unfortunate. I was really hoping to get wood here. But that's just not going to be in cards. All right, let's check the shore first before we go inland. We got. Should probably start thinking about carrying food with us too. These will be cut, yeah. Oh. Hold on a second. Let me go ahead and pour myself some tea real quick here. I completely forgot. Completely forgot. Let me pour some tea. I totally forgot about tea last yesterday. So, let me make sure we have some dumb tea. Oh, wow. that's scary. I don't know what that is. I heard a loud noise and we took some damage. I run back to the computer. Alright, we're gonna hang out over here. I'm sure we'll be fine. I don't know what that was. I don't... It sounded like a pterodactyl. Hold on, pterodactyl. I'm, I'm making some tea. Oh, maybe it's one of those birds that we saw. He just dive bombed us. We said huge bird that we saw on the other island. Unless this is the same island. I don't know. Alright. Incredibly strong tea acquired. Actually, it's pretty good. Actually, pretty good. Pretty good tea. It only required steeping for an hour and 30 minutes. <laughs> I do like strong tea, but it is it is actually quite nice. That's a nice thing about green teas. This is a lot harder to oversteep green teas than it is black teas. But boy, howdy, did I try! Oh, geez. Okay, it is it is a huge bird. What is it doing? Is that like a mating call? Oh, oh. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! That's not good! Okay, I understand what happened now. Um... <laughs> yeah, it's very not good. The majestic rock. Dropping rocks. A thematic. We're going to completely ignore it for right now. Best of our ability. We're gonna just harvest what we can on the island here and then run home. We're just gonna harvest everything we can down here and ignore them best we can. Because we, we need these planks and these prawns quickly. More leaves. Melons. We just are playing around on the outer edge of the island. We can explore inward a little more. He wants you to mate with the uh, with a rock. It's like, hey, just, just, just want you to introduce you to my best friend, Large Boulder. <laughs> my friend Large Boulder is a hugger, so hope you're ready. Wish. There's a lot of wood here. This is great. 
I'm also stockpiling on coconuts and mangoes right now, too. I don't think we've got any mangoes yet. Yeah, coconuts. Which is good, because I think we need coconuts for some smoothies. We can eat some of these if needed, but ideally we don't eat them at all. We save them for whatever this movie. What are you? Is it an alpaca? What are you? Are you hostile? No, take your brains away. Perfect. We need to go get ourselves a bow. We're just going to ignore this guy until we get a bow. Which requires us to get more seed. We need to get ourselves some goop. You're just going to run from me, right? <laughs> Look at that goopy run. Right. And a ram. Oh my goodness. Cool. We're just going to keep harvesting on the lower side of the island here. We need to get going. Food's becoming a problem. Inventory's going to start becoming a problem, too. Which is a great problem. We love this problem. Inventory is our favorite problem to have. I cannot wait until we expand the ship so that we can end up having more crop plots. We can start going crazy with, uh, with growing. It looks like he hasn't eaten anything else. It's good. We made it back just in time. Oh, all right. Let's just go and slide on down the hill. Let's get onto our our arrow of justice. Or the arrow to adventure. Where's adventure? That way. <laughs> Can't you see the arrow? Hey, get off that. Oh, you're gonna break it. Don't do it. Don't do it. No. Oh, thank goodness. Got it. No. Ugh. Walk over slowly because I'm so hungry. Goodness. Moving slowly like that is brutal. Right, catch. Solved. Water next. All right, topped off. This guy going again. Man, this is so nice. We don't have to use planks to get our water. Absolutely huge. It's one too many, right? Basic foundation. We'll go and fill this guy up as we can. We have so much wood now. That's huge. Bunch of nails. Not enough. Ah, okay. We're going to a bunch of rope. Here we go. Slowly working on it though. Do I have more palm leaves in the I do. Make a second. Yes. Two more than that side's done. And then once that side's done, we can do this side. But realistically, we only actually need two sides. The other side will be nice to have, but it's not it's not required. So what we might do is we might actually just build with that empty hole going all the way down here and all along the back. We realistically only need a few sides. The rest is just a nice to have. Especially if it overflows, right? Because if it overflows, which my assumption is it's on 10, or sorry, 5, and then 10 would be the advanced ones. Then if it overflows with 5 and it misses it, then the one on the other side would catch it. So it's still good to have, it's just much lower priority. Alright, let's go ahead and just drop this stuff on. Some wood. Let's leave the bait in here because we really need it. Bronze. Drop all of these off. I know what I'm dropping off here. Nice. And then these have overflowed, so that's good. Over to our seeds. Them off. Our metal. Drop you off. 
more, more. All right, more potatoes. What do we need for this? What is it, rope and planks? We could just do that real quick, right? We can get another one going. The second baby crop plot. I don't know how big the medium one is, but I think that's what we're gonna need for like the melons and the like. We believe it for now. Let's go get another thing of food going. I don't think we have. Yeah, we're all out of. How big is the salmon? We're all out of catfish. How big is the salmon? Oh, don't you dare! The salmon looks like it's about the same size as the catfish. Yeah, it is. Oh my goodness, this thing's huge! <laughs> Look at this bad boy. He's massive. We should start looking. Oh no, it's the vine goo. I was gonna say we should start looking making the cooking pot, but the vine goo is what we're really limited on. We have some of the seaweed, but not enough. So what, three, so four vine goo in total. It, not enough. All right. On the bright side, we'll be heading back inland during the daytime at this rate. Pick up. We need the vine goo to get arrows. So again, I'm tempted to not try and go too far on the island, but also the amount of wood that's there is just way too tempting. Two shovel binoculars. Those bottles are too expensive. Four eight. Eight goop. Goodness. I cannot wait to start building all this stuff. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome. Alright, let's see. What else do we have here that we can do? So we can start looking towards a circuit board. We have one goo on hand right now. We, got the, we can make it one circuit board. What do we need for the... Hey! I mean, he's going for the, the front of the ship. I'm actually quite happy that he keeps going to the front. Quite happy about that. Right, where was I? So what do we need for... What was I looking at? Circuit board for smoothies. Do we have a blender? Is a blender on? Oh no, we need to still unlock a blender. We need to make a circuit board to unlock the blender. The juicer. Buying base foods into amazing drinks. Let's go make one real quick. So we just need some plastic. We just need some copper, which I think was like what two, two copper for that circuit board. Two. Yeah. Fine goo. Two of these. And one goo that we got. Make the circuit board. And then we'll go ahead and research the board. Oh, Lee, look at how much that unlocked. Okay, so we can make the antenna and the sprawl the sprinkler. Okay, I'm excited to play with the sprinkler. Seems to be missing a battery, though. Let's we'll have to look into that. Used to locate nearby radio signals. It's probably useful. We need a battery. Maybe we unlock batteries already, though, right? Yeah, batteries are already unlocked. Okay. Not much more for us to learn here. Dirt. Looks dirty. Okay, so we actually just need to make a shovel for that. Which we can do. We've got the planks that we need. We can make the bolt. We need. Yeah, we can do that. I can make a shovel over here on land. Bolt shovel. What's this thing look like? Oh my good gracious, it doesn't look like a shovel. <laughs> look at this thing! Okay, when you get a bow and arrow, one arrow kills the seagulls that sits on the scarecrow? Oh, that's great. Oh, wait, so there might actually be specific dirt patches. I can't just... I can't just shovel whatever I want. Okay. Oh! Seagull. Stop it. So in the meantime, leave this tool here for later. It's good to have one. We're going to need it eventually. I'm confident. So now that we can do that, we can now make the cooking tables, the blender. We need a bolt and... Ah, fine goo. 
We're one vine goose short. We've got three seaweed. We need four. We're going to build that. Darn. Close, but not quite. Sprinkler requires a battery. Uh, one vine goo. And the battery requires just one copper bar. So we can get copper ingot. We can do that. We can make the battery. And can I research a battery? Can. Uh, I needed it for something. I don't know what. It's gone now. Maybe something for the future that I'm just not aware of. <laughs> we gained nothing from that. There's a lot of goo uh, around the big island. I mean, vines for the goo. Okay. Yeah, we can take a look at that. I'll make another battery. Put that battery there. Okay. Alright, is there anything else we want to take before we head off? Yeah, let's go make sure we have food sorted. Got the salmon. Okay, so salmon and catfish are one and the same, more or less. Let's have, go ahead and get another salmon online then. There we go. Uh, let's go ahead and top ourselves off with water, and then we're out of here. Please refill the water that we use. Alright, let's head back up. It'd be nice to actually take some food with us, but we're just not going to right now. We want to keep our inventory relatively empty. More space to gather stuff. But yeah, the, sh the ship looks in kind of shambles right now, but it's okay. As we get more wood and we get more plastic, we'll build it out. So we are going to have to go and hunt for more plastic soon. Okay, so we can go slightly more to the inner side of the island now. We've done, done one full perimeter sweep grabbed all the wood we possibly can, and now we want to go one layer deeper, which is what we're doing now. Looks like we're kind of going up the main path here. Uh, we don't have any way to really combat the flying nonsense. Yeah, we're just going to have to keep moving, I guess. Just don't stand in one place. It seems to be all we need to do is just keep moving. Keep the spear out just in case. I don't know if this thing's going to come in for melee. Holy jeez! <laughs> wow! Oh my goodness! There's a boar here. And it's, it's pissed. I didn't know I was going to go boar hunting. Okay. It hurts, but not that bad. Okay, it hurts pretty bad when I'm stuck on him. That's not good. Oh, I can't be right next to him. Move. Quickly down the hill. Back down the hill. Alright, I thought we were going to be okay. What the? Where? Where did he come from? What? We lose uh, two-thirds of our inventory. Oof. That's our first death. Oh my goodness, wait, what? Holy, uh, wait, are we able to loot our inventory? We lost two-thirds of our inventory. We lost all of our good tools. Oh, that is brutal. We need to get a bow online. We need to get a bow online. Luckily, we have all the materials we need to rebuild all the parts and pieces or the equipment that we are carrying. We've got plenty. We can rebuild it all. I'm glad that we already, like, dropped off everything first. Oh, well. Let's actually shove off. We'll come back to this island later. We I think this is the second time. I'm assuming this is the same island. We need to go and get more parts and pieces to get ourselves up and running. Because we lost those. But besides, I don't think we have the capacity to actually take out that boar right now. So that is A-OK -okay with me. Let's go ahead and let's get some more parts and pieces. First, we need to harvest a lot more, and we now have more harvesting capacity. So let's focus on getting our harvesting up and running, the max. Get some max capacity harvesting here. This way.
Oh, come on now. We can make it. Actually, actually, no, wait, hold on a second. No, we can't. We can't make it all. We're going to be stuck on this island. Wink. Keep turning. Perfect. Done. Stop turning. Don't turn anymore. <laughs> Perfect. We're almost perfectly straight. Maybe we can just nudge this a little. Can we, can we, can we nudge this rock a little more? Yes. Yes. Oh my goodness, it's perfect. Perfect. I reefed the sails. Weigh the anchor. Excellent. Got some stuff in the shallows here. I must well pick them up. You believe I can take him? I probably can. Uh, if we just go with just the bare minimum required to, to fight him. We probably could. But I'd rather come back a little more prepared. We're not quite as prepared as I'd like to be. Please, is there any seaweed and like down here we can play with? No, it doesn't look like it. Just scrap. No, not, not stuff we need. I want to go head off a little further. Okay, we're now properly oriented. See, so yeah, I'm gonna move away from those rocks first. I want to get the ship in ship shape as soon as we can. But we will definitely take him later. We're gonna need the leather to make armor. Which I think is gonna be really good for us to do. But we went and got all the wood, which is the big thing we wanted to do. That's the big reason why we wanted landfall. This wood. I gotta find something to do with all these stones. I have no idea what to do with all those. Okay, so first things first, we're gonna need to make one of these again. We need two ingots and gold. Oh, wait a second. Has it always been like this, where I just have to open the inventory? Probably not. Alright, what are the other things I'm missing in my inventory? We need an axe. Tools. We need an axe. Rope, planks, bolt. Doesn't work like that. At least we have to craft it that way. Yes, yeah, so we need an axe. We need a fishing pole. Is that it for tools? Oh, we had a paddle, didn't we? Yeah, we did. So I want, I want you. Hey. Come on, you. All right. So, just collection, this is what we need. We need mass collection right now. All right, so we've shoved off far enough this way. Now it's time for us to orient ourselves perfectly straight, in line with the wind. Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. Let's go. What's that other island we came from before? Alright, we just need to actually acquire materials, which currently there's no materials on our path here. I don't know how the spawning of scrap really works. We just need planks, planks, and nails. Ooh, we don't have enough. We'll get ourselves re outfitted here. Go ahead and eat up and drink up. Pull. So yeah, I think the next thing is to go and get a bunch of vine goo. Vine goo needs to be a big priority for us when we hit islands. Thought I heard him. Thought I heard him. I was ready. Perfect. Ready. Oh, perfect. Here we go. We're going straight into the scrap fields. Let's go. Time to start picking up a whole bunch of goodies. Again, these things that we're going to be building on the sides aren't going to be grabbing as much now, but it'll definitely help if we're not in, if we're not perfectly in line. We're more or less perfectly in line now, but we'll have a set up this way. Grab that. 
again. The plastic is nice, but the oh, I totally lift it. But the wood and the bronze are more important. Now I know we're hungry, but hold on, let me grab these. Make sure we don't lose this. this stuff's good. We need it. More stones. I just have to start throwing stones out because they take up too much inventory space. Alright. This is about broken. this until it breaks. Ooh, that's a jackpot right there. Wood and palm leaves. Wood and palm leaves. There it goes, broken. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Alright, what do we need for another one? Two ropes and more scrap. Really, I'm not carrying enough scrap in inventory? Interesting. Just we're using them for our um, nails. Yeah, so we're going to be low on rope a little bit here. Alright, tools wise. Let's see. Bolts and a bunch of rope. Do I have fronds in here? Probably not. Yeah. Rope's going to be a tough one. We want to go ahead and get a fishing rod soon. We can at least make the axe now. It's going to be more important since we have an island over there that we can go ahead and get some more wood from. Built. Plenty of... Oh my goodness, the jellyfish. Gorgeous. Here you Move a little bit. The port. Compensate. Also, we want to go and grab those barrels if we can. Get some of this plastic. I can get one of them. The wood. Passively. Oh, more decorative stuff. What do we get? We learned how to build a sunflower. Nice. Take it. Well, I didn't mean to eat the potato, but yeah, I'll take the potato as well. A nice raw potato. You know, you gotta get your minerals in somehow, right? on moving over here. I don't know exactly. Yeah, maybe we want to go straight to port here. Wedge ourselves a little bit in there. We want to make sure we don't get caught, though. We don't, we don't want to spin. We've already spun enough. We don't want to spin anymore. We've managed to finally get ourselves to be properly oriented. If we can avoid spinning, that'd be great. Uh, let's just get to the far... What is that? East side of the island? I don't know which way is north here. Yeah, I'm just going to kind of cruise around here. Hey! Not that. Not that you. This seems like a pretty good spot right here, actually. Go reef the sail. Anchor. Yes, this is a good spot right here. I like it. And what we'll do is we'll preset our sail. Open the sucker back up. Preset the sail to move perfectly away from the island. So the moment that we can, we are out of here. And that way we don't accidentally catch anything. Okay, first things first, let's go and grab everything off the island. We can go hunt underwater in the morning, hopefully. Nice. 
This vine goo is a big thing we gotta look for today. Gotta get that vine goo. Other things are important, of course. But vine goo's the big one. We need to go ahead and make... I mean, binoculars would be nice, but I think the high, the top tier priority for us here... Three levels, I think. I think our top tier priority... Oh! <laughs> I think our top tier priority here is gonna have to be going for that bow. So if we get that bow, we can take out that boar. We just have to take advantage of climbing. Thing that boars aren't the best at. Alright, let's try doing that bait. Let's see how that bait works. Try and bait and kill the shark here. Bunch of spare wood. Huge. Little spare fronds. Very happy about that. Melons and apple and mangoes. Nice. I wonder what they stack. I guess they stack up to 20, huh? Seeds. Here we go. More nails. I should get this set. That skip for a rebuild. Start doing some more metal burning soon. Not yet. Hold off a little longer. Okay, let's see here. So, we still need to get ourselves some rope. Stack that properly. Make enough space. Now let's make sure we have food prepped. What are we gonna cook? Let's keep going to the fish here. Pull another salmon. Make it up. Now, we have our bait in here, yeah? Yes. Okay, so, with the bait and the shark, I'm assuming we bait out off of the ship? Oh, okay. I press and hold, not just click. I see, so he keeps coming to the bait. We just hit him each time he comes to the bait, right? him immediately and he just left. No? Not too sure how this works. Can't pick it up and move it. Oh! Hello. Surprise, surprise. If the bait is there, does that have him go for the bait instead of me? There he is. Oh, I see. So he gets into the same action that he does with the uh, with grabbing wood. Or your, your foundations. Okay. I see how it works. Cool. I don't know how long the bait lasts. I don't know if it's like until it's completely used or if there's like a time limit on it. Uh, but we got them all set now, so we're good to go. Go ahead and set up our water purification and let's just go to town with harvesting underwater. First and foremost, fine goo. Oh, and a, and a chest actually. The bolts, decorative package. Oh my goodness. Decorations. I like decorations. And I said we were going to go for vine goo, and I immediately get distracted. We're just going to do a, a swim around of all the vine goo that we can. And we'll do another swim around, and we'll grab all of the. Both at the same time, right? Nah, let's just focus on the vine goo. Just keep getting all the seaweed. Because then what we can do is we can get that. Uh, cooking at the same time. I 
also go and pick all up all the uh, floating debris here too. I do gotta say, seeing all of these planks kind of makes me suspicious, right? Why are there planks floating on the ocean? It's not like random logs as if like the world got uh, hit by a massive uh, tsunami or something. No, no, it's it's planks, planed wood, right? It's almost as if this is like the like the end of like an apocalypse happened during a, like the pirate age, right? Why are there so many planed pieces of wood? Nice flat chunks of wood. All right, I can't I can't help it. We're gonna be looting everything together at the same time during the circuit. Predominantly, we'll be looking at getting our metals and our seed at the same time. I can't help it. It's right there. These planks. Planks are super important. Plastic color here. Yank that out of the wall. Grab ourselves some copper. What else here? Scooting around. Planks, though. Planks. Plastic and planks. Perfect. So peaceful without the shark. It really gives us the opportunity to kind of go find everything. We don't have to rush or worry. I don't know if we need to get more sand and more clay right now. We don't have much use for them. We already have more than a stack of each. Um... I guess we'll probably need it to make the fireplace, but beyond that, I really can't think of anything else that we would need those bricks for. Sure. Here, here. Right? No. Okay. I was wondering if I could throw this while swimming. If I was above water. Because if that was the case, I'd go for those barrels. They're just kind of far away. I would still grab it or something. Grab this barrel in the crate. As long as the shark doesn't come back, we'll be fine. If we pop this far out in the water, we'll be in a lot of trouble. Yeah, I'm completely full on inventory now. We gotta be careful about what we're going for. Maybe we head back to... Let's head back to the raft, and we'll just go counterclockwise here. Oh, actually, we'll go proper clockwise. Make sure we actually get all the metal. There's just a lot of metal at this island. There we go. Drop you off, drop you off. Drop off, you off. Metal here. Bunch of seaweed. Perfect. We like that. Nice little scrap of wood. Potatoes. Yeah, we've got, already got a stack and a half here. Let's just drop off this bolt and hinge that we got. Uh, we'll drop off the wood. We got a bunch of wood. So right now, that means plastic and palm leaves are what we need. Plastic and palm leaves, the ones we need. Okay, that's still here. Maybe that just sits until it's used. Hmm. All right, what do we get? We've unlocked a chair and a fire basket. Oh, that's cool. I like that. I like the sounds of that. Put water up. Right. Back in the water we go. Alright, so the shark has despawned. But we'll be back at any moment. I think that's the last of the seaweed. Let's oxygen up, and let's go for all the metal. Because again, metal is something I know we're going to need an absolute bunch of over the time. 
because we're going to have to keep rebuilding our tools. We're going to need just a ridiculous amount of it. Luckily, this island is absolutely covered in it. Here. There. I keep my head up for whenever he decides to pop, pop back into existence. The Nibbleton the third. here. Picked up all the seaweed on our trip now. I know we did skip some metal at the start of our circuit. I'm gonna keep an eye out for that. We got plenty, well, we got a decent amount of scrap. We probably should be picking up more scrap. Probably should be picking up more scrap. If we get the opportunity, we'll grab more scrap, but we're not gonna, like, sit around forever to go grab it all. If we get the opportunity to, we'll go nab it. But for now, let's just keep hunting for all the, all the metal. I thought I skipped some. When we first started doing a circuit. Did I just, like, imagine it? Did we not? I still don't see him. There's some copper here. This is the very beginning of our circuit. Huh. I guess it's just these four little nodules of, uh, of copper is what I missed. Alright. After that, I guess we'll go for the copper. Or, uh, we'll go for the scrap. Oh, there he is! Meow. There. Didn't go for the stuff. Uh, interesting. Hold on, let me... Get all of them. Okay, let's get out of here. Only get bit one more time before we die. We gotta go. Nope. Okay. Will you go for this again? That's the question. Will you go for that again? Because if so, we can try and take it down a second time. It will. Kind of let's go the same way as okay i see so let's go the same way but this way we just while we're doing stuff here the moment we hear that noise we know where it's going to be go for them okay and we just keep poking them okay interesting i don't know it feels a little cheaty to me but you know if it works it works let's get some more copper burning right now Actually, we need goo, technically, when we work on more so than anything else. Hey, up there. We're working on goo instead. Goo's more important right now. I'm gonna pick up some scrap, too. Is How much scrap do we have in there? Only one set of 20. Yeah, no, this bait works really well. This bait feels a little broken, to be honest. There right. goes. Oh. Alright. Our air bottle's gone, too. Man. In fact, this stuff breaks. What's that? We're like four or five more hits off. It's gonna be a bit before we can actually take him down. How's it going, bad skin? <laughs> How's it going, bad skin with dealer? Bait 2.0 rigged with dynamite? Yeah. Actually, I think that would be a really good version. Man, it would be nice if I pushed this here, but that's okay. Alright. Plastics. How are we with plastics, by the way? Pretty good with plastics. So we can actually do some expansion while we're here. We can finish off the expansion here. So, 
what was our thought? We can finish the side and back while we're while we're here in port. Hey! I just I just put that there. Oh wait, mister. Literally just put that there. True monster right there. Alright, so let's see. Once we hit the side, we got one, two, one, two. Three. Oh. Stop the nibbles. Wow. I should keep doing it. I, I want you to do that. Alright. Where are we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's do one with the eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight to here. Doesn't feel long enough, actually. I think we need to get the ship to be a little longer. Unless we have the anchor house start from this point, and then we clear up pretty much everything from here to there. That could work. Hmm. I still think either way it needs to be bigger. I think either way we do need this to be bigger. Very small? Too small? Yeah, I think it's too small. This puts us at 9 from that point, or 8 otherwise. Let's make the total length of the ship. Total length of the ship. 1, 2... Hey! Nice! One, two, three, four pieces. Put that up. And we need this. Help ourselves off. Perfect. And we get back to looking at building. Okay. in there. Okay. We look at this. We've got one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we're playing with 13 currently. Two more back there to get this thing built. That might be... That might be good enough. Get a 15 long? We can always make it bigger later. I think 15 long is probably good enough. The thing is, I kind of want to have it be a one-piece center, though. I kind of want to make it one wider. So that we have the anchor dead center. But that's not necessary. We could have the anchor literally sit on the side and have it be a storage room with the anchor at the back of the storage room. Also would look pretty nice. Usually anchors aren't in the dead center of a ship. Kinda odd. Maybe we do that. That actually sounds pretty good. We put it on the edge. We just essentially move this sucker over one. So what is it? We need two more. Let's get some wood. Essentially that's where the anchor goes. Hello there. You have it set like that. How's it going, Gilded Hollow? How are you doing today? Hello, hello. And then we just fill this out for the rest, and then we make a backspace. Mm hmm. Only the windlass is in the center? Yeah. Which would be nice to have a center point, but we can actually put it, like we did here, centered between two pieces. Still making it very much centered. Pretty good. How's Graft? I'm loving. I'm loving Graft. It's a lot of fun. I can see the use. Hmm. Plastic, we're all out. Yeah, yeah, we're completely out of plastic now. I think we go head back to the sea. Let's grab some scrap before we go. We took out the shark. Let's do a scrap run. Let's pick up everything scrap related that we can first. Grab all the scrap. Grab a little bit more clay and sand, too. Well, two full stacks of each should be fine. We won't need more than ten, I think, of each. Get us close. 
Let's grab all the scrap we can. We need it for nails and the like. Oh, I actually missed some metal over there. Glad we came back. And then we're gonna be on. I think we need to go and just do a long journey on the ocean of just gathering materials. Predominantly just picking up wood and plastic as we finish off the foundation. And the palm fronds, of course, the palm leaves. We need those so we can get some more of the collectors online. I'd like to finish off that one line, that big empty space that I've created. We can finish off that. All the others are just bonus. Right? But those, those are the important ones. We want two sides of the ship. The very front and one side. Sorted. That we can collect as much as possible. Very little's going to slip through the cracks if we have that set up. That'll be good. I really want to build this guy out more. Yeah, it's a it's a struggle to get the resources. I like this. I like just how tough it is to get the materials you need to build a big ship. It's it already makes me feel very accomplished with the tiny ship that we have right now. The one-story raft that we have that isn't a full full sailing ship right now. We'll feel accomplished. Nice. New scrap. Sand more clay. Or any other metals we've missed. Wonder what kind of scrap this is. It looks kind of like ship parts to me. Like railings and the like. Like spots for you to have a post. I don't know. <laughs> Although that looks like a muffler, so. Oxygen back up. Really enjoy this game. Definitely a challenge gathering uh, enough materials. Yeah, and that's one of the things I like. Your parts from a nuclear testing contract in the 40s and 50s? Could be. Just all leftover parts from the, uh, the dummy ships that they blew up. Right, that's uh, pretty much a full circuit here. I think we are done. Oh, missed some metal over here. I think we're done. Yeah, nice. Something to think about, too, is we could also always build this with, like, a hole. Like, leave this hole here. Or maybe expand it. Or do something where you, like... What we can do is we can have it so that we can, like, jump up and out, you know? From underneath, if we go exploring underwater. Speaking of which, it's done. Looked green to me. Might be kind of nice. Have a moon pool, essentially. Might be kind of cool. Go and top off on water again. Production underway. A catamaran style boat would have been neato, but I guess it's uh, too little room to build. Yeah, that would be too tiny. Just like a little skiff running around. Alright, I think we're gonna call it here and head off, right? Nothing else we really need. I mean, the rest of it's just mostly rocks, so let's, uh, let's get up and out of here. Lift her up. Oh, whoa! Came with a little too much power. Alright, we need to get ourselves back into the debris current here. We gotta get back in the debris field. Let's just keep on scooting over to starboard, or our port over here. 
Because we want to fill this whole section up with collectors. We might end up having this be a little longer to wrap around with the collectors on the back end, but realistically, three ends should be, like, way more now. Yeah, let's get back in this debris field, and we'll start moving at full speed ahead. And really, it's just coming down to plastic. We just need plastic. We've got none. Completely out of plastic. Plastic bolt. We'll get the vine goo going. So let's get this juicer. We've got a whole bunch of fruits. We need to get the juicer on. Ocean plastic? There ain't, <laughs> there ain't any. I know, right? Typical, indeed. Start pulling in some goo. Planks. Wait, needs fresh water? Since when? Since when have our potatoes ever needed fresh water? When it rains, does it automatically water our crops? When it rains, does it automatically water our crops? I'm starting to get the feeling that I've just been running off of rain water. Yeah? Yeah, it is? Yep. Okay. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. We are going to keep shooting the port here. Which is good, because we have these angles here. This is the whole reason why we need to get these set up, because we can grab extras. Right, like this stuff here is flattening on by. Alright, so that's what we've been using. I, I tried to fill it once, but there was already water in it because it must have been raining at the time. And then I just assumed I just didn't need to water it. Well, well, well then. So if we go straight to that island, we can go get some more wood. Let's straight over to that island. Let's go pick up some more wood. Let's see here. Enough, we can get one more. Them nails. I might turn the orientation of these. Make them just look prettier. Eh, they're fine the way they are. You go much harder to port. Hard to port! Alright, perfect. Alright, so with you. I can remove and pick you up, right? Perfect. Good jump in. The only thing is, I don't know if this is going to be in trouble from Shark Man coming by. Let's go ahead and let's get one more. Actually, hmm. That's fine. We'll go one more back. We can angle off. What is that? Water? Yeah, I have sea water. We'll drop that. Pretty much the only reason why we're here is to grab the uh, trees. Don't hit it. Don't hit it. Nope. Away. Okay. Here's the sail. Anchor. Oof, that was close. We're pointing the right direction. I uh, will unreach the sail. Get that guy full mast. Okay, perfect. Off we go. Oof. How's it going, Am Good? How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. Before we do this, let's make sure that uh, we've got goo going. So I think that finished it did. We need to get goo going at full speed. Alright. Time for wood. Alrighty. This is a new island design. I don't think I've seen it like this before. Ah, 
Ah, uh, yeah, look at our good old arrow. The arrow is starting to even out here as we start filling this out. It's looking good. We're getting there. Get a couple more of these all the way down. Cap off the bottom. Get the left side done as well. Build a back cabin and a front cabin. Because, again, we're going to design this like a cog. It might make it difficult to actually control the sail if we do it that way. I'm assuming the sail doesn't count, doesn't care if it's completely surrounded by other buildings. I'm assuming there isn't a mechanic that requires, like, wind access. Uh, please let me know if I'm wrong. That'll completely change our design. Um, but those of you who are... The shark doesn't attack uh, when you're not on the raft. I don't think it does. I don't think it does. This doesn't seem... If I'm near the raft, it does. If I'm near the raft, it still does. There have been times that it's done that. Not much on the island, huh? Good. The sail is fine wherever you put it. Excellent, okay. Perfect, perfect. Wow, look at this area. This is cool. This is... This is a really cool spot. Oh my goodness. It's like Subnautica level right here. We're probably going to get surprised nibbled on. So I'll just... Quick heads up. Grab ourselves more metals. Yep, there he is. Hey, okay, can't let us have a nice, relaxing trip on this. Okay, we gotta get out. Oh, we gotta get out. Ow. Now my toes. My poor toes. Okay. Grab some metal. It's pretty good. We'll head back here real quick. We can get a little work done while we wait for our health. Oh, you don't. Get off, you. You're gone. Okay. Full yet. Let's go ahead and drop off. Food. Flam. Metals. Weed. We're just going to keep making goo. Let's seeds. Yeah, I cannot wait until we get a center plate start actually growing. So it does need fresh water. Look at that. It says it right there. Look at fish. Hey. Take these planks. Going. Right. Just want to make sure we're nice and topped off. Hey! Let's stop it. Goodness. Drops. Water myself. We got the flowers? Yeah, we got all of the flowers already. We've already got a full set of flowers on hand. So we're ignoring the flowers, otherwise our inventory is going to be way overtaken. There are always two seals. Really? So if we have more than one scarecrow, would that counter them? Oh, by the way, here are all the flowers. There are a bunch of flowers already. We got the seeds, so we can grow more as needed. So let's go ahead and get another one here. Plastic. Plastic. So much more plastic needed. Yeah, I'd like to have our bed in a better spot. Don't like it right there. Paint raft? Yeah, we'll end up painting eventually, but uh, low priority, to be honest. Roll on here. 
If the grills can just keep on grilling, we might as well get another mackerel done. Eventually, we're going to want a raw foods chest and a finished foods chest. Or maybe we just have a full foods chest with uh, finished food at the bottom. Something we could do. It also might be nice to go and get our simple grill back online, too. Just remember we need to do one quick cook of something tiny. I think it is more efficient with this, though. Oh, there's that. Give me that mackerel. Come on now. Up and through. Pretty shark. There it is. Perfect. Alright. Popped off. Put a little more water in us and we're done. Nice. Alright, we can head back to getting things done. Uh, first things first, let's get more poop going. Starting to run low on that. But we have goop. Alright, so that should be enough goop for us to start working on you. So, ah, oh, we need plastic, though. I think we need some glass. I think we have a glass right now. down. Make some glass. All right, let's go hunting. Go hunting for items. Seaweed. Maybe there's more goop. Get some sand while we're here. I don't think we have enough. I think I hear him. the storm. Must be on the wrong side of the island. Take him a minute to get here. We're back at full health, so we can go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and scrap these. We need this material anyway. Especially the plastic. Goodness. Put some back. Grab a little bit of this that's floating out here that we won't be getting with this ship. Right. Let's see, we got some more sand. Realistically, we shouldn't get any more. We already have two stacks at this point. Start focusing exclusively on metal things. Scrap and the like. Scrap, metal, copper, seaweed. seaweed. Mm, I don't like how out I am. If we get bit, we're immediately going to have to go to shore. Because we're pretty far away from safety. We should actually just bring the raft over here. Go back to the raft. Let's let's go ahead and see if we can. I don't know if the wind will let us. Oh, he's still floating over there. Okay. Oh, water! <laughs> Too much water! Quick air! Yeah, let's go back to the raft. Let's move the raft over here if we can. Wave almost made it. Too troublesome. Back up. Too tough. Too difficult. Alright. Go ahead and keep getting the goop going. We just need a lot of goop. I don't think there's any use for just the basic seaweed. I think the seaweed is exclusively used for making goop. Okay, we've got too much sand now. And we're getting close there on clay as well. Oh! Yeah, that's why we built that, right? Just gonna cap this here. We're going to fill in the rest of this space. We'll fill in these as well. Unless I'm going to leave it as one glow. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to close those, because we're going to need a place for props. Mm 
in place of props. For me, water the potatoes, water myself. the anchor. We're going to move to the side and try and move back. The wind is oof, not on our side. And we might end up just leaving. Now that we're up and away here, we go back. We go backwards exactly against the wind. Let's just head on out. Let's show off. We've got enough. We've got enough for what we needed to get done. Plenty of extra metal. Look at there. Plenty of metal right now. We're a okay on it. Bunch of extra scrap as well, which is great. Really just need to get more wood, leaves, and most importantly, plastic. We are struggling on plastic. Let's head off into the fields. Back into the plastic fields. Right this way. I want to get more and more collectors, too. The more collectors we get, the less work we have to do. Alright. Sprinklers is something we'll play with down the line, but let's continue to focus on making this juicer. The thing we could do is make the cooking pot, but the juicer I'm more interested in right now, because we have the, all, that, all that info that's been thrown at us. We've got a bunch of smoothie recipes. Let's do this circuit board, which is two copper. Made. Bolt. Done. The atmosphere when you're on the raft is so nice, feels so cozy. I know, right? It's so it's such a relaxing game. Except of course, you know, when you're dealing with the, the shark. Hold on a second, let's spin back over here real quick. Go and rope this. Debris field over there. Yeah, these grow actually surprisingly fast, those potatoes. Alright, we just need six plastic. We got some wood, I'll take it. Let's keep making goop. Oh, yeah, here we go. That's some plastic right there. One, two, three, four. I see a good amount. You get caught? Perfect. Yeah, down here we don't have any catchers yet. We'll just grab by hand. No need to waste the durability on this tool. Huh? Oh! <laughs> I fell through the hole! That's not good. Yeah, I definitely need to get those holes plugged up. Yeah, I'm gonna need to plug up those holes. Plastic's at three. Four. Five. One more. Harder and harder for us to defend, huh? Being able to get here in time, it's gonna get tougher to do. Right, juicer acquired. Oh, it's a huge station! This thing isn't small at all! Okay. We're gonna need to make a galley. 
Oh, we're gonna have to make a kitchen. Oh, this is gonna be so nice. Cause we got this. We got a. F oh my goodness. Cause we got what? A grill, a water purifier, a juicer, and a, uh, a cooking pot. We're gonna we're gonna be able to make a little galley. Might be the back space here where we have this instead of storage. We have it be our galley in the back. A galley with the anchor. Kind of makes sense. Oh my goodness. Wait a second. Hold on. Take a quick take a quick stock here. With a bunch of plastic over. Oh, fans! A bunch of plastic over there. Actually, want to go over there. See, we'd go in. Plastic. Now, well, the way we're going is still fine. Okay. That's okay. Back up. I can grab at least one of them. Got one. Okay. Still collecting things. Again, this is the reason why we want to get more of these collectors down here. Uh, let's see. We need to make some glass so we can make some cups, right? So we just need to go and grab. Um, sand. Planks. On collecting. Alright. So while we wait on that, what do we need for this? Rope. We should have still some nails somewhere, right? Oh, we're out of nails. Plastic. Okay. Let's some collection net so we grab more. Ooh. What do we get? A rug! Oh my goodness, two rug- we now have two different rug patterns. Nice. Unfortunately, while we are oriented with the wind, we're really oriented with where the junk is. <laughs> oh, we'll just keep moseying on sideways for now. Can I get another one? Oh, we just can. Perfect. Nice. We got what? One, two, three, four more on this line here. Perfect. Okay, how does this work? It takes a battery. Not a battery. Plug the battery in. Okay. And then I take the smoothie recipe that we have, right? I think that's it. Ah, I see. The, the simple juice smoothie here. Got a lot of them. Uh, I don't really know what to do with those. Oh, jeez, game. Glass. More goop. So we get four. Oh my goodness, look at these mugs. Can't see what it says. Drixen? I guess what it says. Okay. Let's make sure we keep collecting. And you don't. Get off, mister. Oh, can I get a double? Yes. It is. It is starting to overflow. Excellent. 
tools. Hey, stop that. Tools. We need two ropes. We need a bolt. We need some scrap. Bolt. Some scrap. so peaceful right now just fully moseying along grabbing just just picking up random debris so nice yeah let's go ahead and fill this out we don't need that hole in the middle anymore but yeah we're gonna start setting up a but i'm thinking now okay so now i'm thinking we have the back of the ships because we're gonna have this be two floors Currently, with a with a downstairs in the center in between is our thought. We'll see if that ends up being the final design or not. Are you? Nice some rope. So what I'm thinking is the back's going to be the galley and the anchor. The front um, downstairs can be the bedroom. And I don't know, this is a huge one. I'm still not ready to land. They're still working on stuff. Unfortunate because we found a big island. That's okay. We'll continue to motor around. We'll eventually find these islands again, it seems like. Uh, but yeah, so we'll have the front be the bedroom. The back be the galley. We can have the center be our garden, I think, is what we'll have. We might, instead of having the sail in the center, like I was thinking, we just have a forward mast, which isn't really what you do in real life, but that's fine. We can put that on top of the, on top of the bedroom, have the mast up at the top there. That might be nice. And then... We'll have the garden here, and then maybe a uh, crafting station on the back aft. You know? We can do that. We need to put ingredients on the table. Oh, yeah, and for this. Oh, I see, on here. I thought we were going to be dumping them in there. Okay. Cool, cool. Let's go and grab all this stuff here first. Before these collectors get full. End up losing stuff. Get ourselves sorted here. And then let's play with this juicer. Water. Oh, actually, quick test. This is important. Okay, so you can't grab salt water from here, but you can fall through it. I seem to know that for where we're going to put our water purifier. Because when we, when we move over and have a kitchen for it, we're going to need to know where the water purifier is going to need to go. Keep going with the goop. Keep getting that goop done. Alright, so now... Alright, okay. Ooh, we got a new decoration. It's a brand new flag! Nice, okay. Ooh. Alright, so we need... One pineapple. A mango. Coconuts. Start cooking. <laughs> I didn't even notice you actually use an engine. Nice. I can't let this go by. Put the anchor down for a second. We might swing on over and pick up some wood or something there. Right, how long does this take? Quite some time, apparently. Back off you. Rocks for the rock pile. Ooh, another decoration. Another flag. Nice. Okay, so the other thing we were looking at doing is this, which requires just metal. We got this one covered. Cooking pot is all okay, so I thought it was going to be pretty big. Yes. Alright. Perfect. So yeah, we'll definitely set up a galley over here. We just need to make sure we have enough space. One, two, three cooking stations so far. We can always expand the galley backwards since it is in the back. We can shove everything backwards. Definitely doable. 
We don't have any recipes for this, though. Oh, it's done. Achievement unlocked. A more complex concoction. The meal by following a recipe. Requires a drinking glass. Okay. All of that for only one smoothie. Standard smoothie, but delicious. <laughs> Cute. Okay. Uh, when we drink it... Oh, interesting. We get food, water, and excess hydration. We get, like, a bonus hydration. We also apparently eat the glass. So that's a little concerning uh, for our health and the like. But, um, okay. Also looks like the battery, I think, gives us three... I'm assuming three juices per juice of battery. That's what it looks like. Um, that's good. Okay. Cool. We want different boxes then. A box from for fish meat. A box for smoothie stuff. We could do that. We could do main box. We could do like a full box. We don't have to do the small containers. Okay. Yeah. All right. I, I like where this is going. I like where this is going. I have ideas. I have ideas. I have plans. I like where this is going. So we're gonna start doing a whole bunch with this soon. For now, I'll put our smoothie cups in here. Uh, the excess bar drains slower than the regular bar. Oh, that's good. I just assumed it drained at the same speed. My assumption would be wrong. Let's keep the goop going. Grab some more. Probably rebuild this. Pair some stuff. Okay, we're still in dire need of plastics. Which? Plastics. Okay. Let's go ahead and let's corner this. Oh. Corner this off so we know this is the corner. This is the end of the ship. Achievement unlocked. Build 100 foundations. Hey! Intermediate builder. Nice. We're so crafty. Alright, so we just need to fill in this section of three here, and then we're done with the base layout of the ship. For now, at least. Until we scoop all the way over here and extend this section out. Because again, we still need two more. But we're not going to be building actual, like, buildings on top of it. None of our crafting stations go on there. It's just going to be a buffer on the outside. For you. It's going to be a buffer on the outside and collectors, and then it will be the actual space. So I guess the next thing to look at is walls. Patch walls, solid walls, wooden walls. I don't want to put the brace on the inside. Start building walls. Interesting, but it shelves that way with this top piece. Which one's the inside? Which one's the outside? Is this the outside? I'm starting to feel like it is. I feel like I put these down backwards. This is what it feels like. Alright. Let's stop hanging out here. Let's keep on going. It looks like the only way to take these down is this. Okay, and we do get two planks for doing that. Okay, so we get 50% of the material back. Alright, that's cool. I appreciate we at least get something back instead of nothing. Looks like we can make reinforcements too for the raft. But that's going to be very expensive to fortify. Oh my. 
just to make things sturdy. We're getting way, way beyond peckish. We're quite hungry, actually. Let's get some fish going here. So we're still going to keep this one for bait. Get a fish chest going here in a bit. And then we can go real gung ho with fishing. Great. Alright, now we've got those done. We still need more of these collectors. That's another one. Yep, we just missed some stuff because we didn't have that collector here. And keep making these collectors. Thank you. And again, we'll get the second side of the collectors and the back side of the collectors done later. Low priority. Just need to build off the area. One more. Uh, the fortification can go only on the perimeter. Okay, it's not the entirety of it. Tilapia here. Place those planks. Alright, we're back on it. So this means that the cook pot probably gives us the like ex extra resistance to hunger. Like the extra hunger bar as well as my guess. It's quite nice. Thank you. Ooh, there's a tiny island over there. Let's go to that tiny island. That'll be useful. Not a big and imposing island. Still this tiny guy over here. How's it going, left hand Luke? How are you doing today? Guess whose arm was twisted to spend four hours of raft yesterday? <laughs> I hope you had fun, left hand Luke. This is a really good game. I'm enjoying this game a lot. I like the freedom that we have for building as well. It's really good. The building freedom we have, I'm really enjoying. So, like, I'm just the prospects of what we can do. I'm so excited. Right, we're, we're slowly building it out now. As I get plastic, we'll get that section set up. We'll leave a hollow space for more collectors, of course. But, uh... Okay, it's you. Another collector. Bam. Two more collectors. We need two more collectors. We're good to go. Oh, the shark, you said bonk. Bonk. How's it going, Dark Soul? How are you doing today? Let's go just hard to starboard here. We went swimming last night and did 62 25 meter lengths of the pool within 50 minutes. A new personal best. That's really good. That's a, that's a lot of strenuous activity. That's good. Keeping you healthy. We can get in as close as we can, and then we'll go ahead and crack the anchor. We don't want to hit the. We don't want to hit land. We don't want to get spun around. It's been a struggle already for us to spin ourselves in the direction we are now. Right. Tuck it. Perfect timing. Look at that. A little gangplank there to get over. Alright, what do we got? We got wood. Barely. Alright. Got a couple trees. Two trees. You may or may not need a uh, starting Elden Ring tomorrow. Oh. Nice. Do you have an idea on what kind of build you're going to be playing there if you start Elden Ring? What kind of style of gameplay you're going for? It's like, there's got to be some pineapple there. Islands, right? 
We'll start harvesting our own soon. But really, all we need is the wood. It's not really much else on at here. I mean, we can always use more of everything. More wood. More stone. Or not more stone. More wood, more metal. No more seaweed. We can always use more of those, but I would much rather continue to go and collect stuff that we've been getting so far. Although we are almost out of seaweed. Eh, fine. There's more seaweed. It's in here too. We get some more seaweed while we're here. That would be a good thing to do. Stones. I just don't know what to do with the stones. I have so many of them. Planks going. Can't, can't actually fill that water up further. I was hoping. Fresh water. Water the crops. Salt water. Up it off. Fine. Can I hit the can I hit the seagull with the spear? Can I do that. Can I stab him. I'm gonna give him a little stab. A quick little poke. Oh, we can start we'll make the bow soon here. Guess we're gonna go bonk with either sword and stick. Nice, nice. I approve. Bonk it. We're gonna try and bonk it next time. It gets in close. Too close. Give it another bonk. Let's see with metal. Is giraffe in the shape of an arrowhead? Uh, for right now it is, but it's not going to be like that long term. We're gonna try and make this thing look like a cog, or you know, kind of like a caravel. That's the goal, at least. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> We're gonna try. Let's grab all the seaweed. Grabbing all the seaweed for a whole bunch of goop is gonna be huge. I feel like he's honest right now. Might not be, but it feels like it. There he is. <laughs> Alright. I think that's it for now. Got a little more metal. Got a bunch more seaweed, which is really the more important thing right now. Just being able to make, keep making goop. More of what we need right now. As you can see, we have more than two stacks of copper. We have almost two full stacks of regular metal. So we're, we're good for right now on it. Collecting more, sure we can, but we just we just don't need it. We need wood more than anything else. Um, easier to place a nest so it sits in whilst you're on the island or in the water, and then you can hit them in the nest. Hmm. Yeah, it said it needed to be far away from where we are, so I just haven't placed it yet because we haven't really had a position to put a nest that we're not running around. All right, let's get up and go. Back to sea. <laughs> we pull that out of the ground so hard, so fast. Lies. Okay. What? I think we might end up having to put this at the front of the ship. Just for steering sake. Otherwise we'd be staring at a wall. Not too, that's not really all that good. We're talking. Look at this collection. All right. Rope, more nails. Struct. One more, and we're done. One more, and we're done here. Do we have any spare leaves? We do. Thanks. 
All right. That side is completed. Perfect. I almost have a full stack of goo, by the way. Hey, stop it. Actually, you're just about done. Next time he attacks, I think we've got him. In which case, we'll just have to check the anchor down. Got nothing else going this way. Let's uh, get back in the stream of junk. Back in the junk stream here. Like a jet stream, but different. Let's go get that crate. Shark not as happy with your raft as you are. It's true. Shark's very unhappy with it. Look at all this, look at all this room for activities we've got. This is huge. Huge. Forward. We're all good to go now. Grab these. No good. All right. And for you. Now, if he does attack this corner, that's going to be sad, but it's fine. It'll be okay. Oh, did I not see it in here? Oh, I got distracted. That's right. All right. Let's take a look at what we can start building. What else can we build here that we need? I wouldn't hurt to go get into the fishing rod soon. We are getting thin on fish. Speaking of which, we should do another cooking run. Yeah, it's going to be our last round of cooking, so we need to go get a, a fishing rod online. We also need to go and start sorting out how we want the kitchen. We're completely out of plastic, right? Yeah, we're completely out of plastic. We're flat out of plastic. Water. Off that water. Go and water myself. One, two, three, four. Three potatoes. Some missing these. We're getting back into a junk field. Perfect. Let's start repairing some of this. We're a little narrow on the front end of the ship, so we're not going to grab as much going straight ahead as going sideways, but that's okay. That's what the hook's for. Oh my goodness, you gotta be kidding me. The hitbox! The hitbox! Okay. Let's we'll get this crate. Looks like that was gonna miss. Ooh, what did we get? String lights! Hey! Alright. I can get behind that. Nice. Potato seeds. I don't really need extras, though. How's it going there, Spessy Buzzy? How are you doing today? You see what I mean by building with triangles instead of the squares? Yeah, they look really nice, too. And I saw uh, lined up. And it's giving us a little more protection, and it is cheaper. You're absolutely right. This. Oh. Hungry. Must. Eat. Food. Bunch of mackerels. Little tilapia. Right as rain. Ooh, another one. What do we get? Oh my goodness, a full a full on sofa. Nice. Holy. Alright. Go ahead and let's build that a little more. Break this down. 
So it goes here. Get one more in the angle. A little more plastic. Wood's still good, but I need plants to add. Get that goo going. Come here, you. Hey. Oh, I thought we had him. One more time, one more time. One more time, we can go ahead and get him. So close. Shark only bites one triangle uh, out, but he will chew the whole square. Yeah. Oh, I see. So if you do two triangles, is what you're saying, yeah? Then he ends up eating only half. Okay. Ah, uh, sounds even better than I thought it was going to be. Wow, okay. I thought you meant just, like, use these as defensive layers. But actually, if you use two triangles for that, yeah, I see what you mean. Those are huge. I don't know if I'm going to do it that way, but... Plastic. Barrels. Plastic. You get outside cover in metal, covered in metal, and then the shark boy can't attack it. Yeah, but we'll, we'll have to get around to the reinforcements later. We need to finish with the, the full layout first. Alright, we're one off. One off. That's the plastic we needed. And we are... Thick in the field of stuff. This is great. Alright. There we go. Now we just need to get our collectors in here. And the base the basic layout of the ship is done. Now we can start building up and start making walls. Huge. We can start making this place look pretty. Also, we found a brand new a quill. Oh, what is we good for a table? Uh, on the left side there, or on the port side. Excuse me. Love that heat. All right. So what we need is fishing rod, bolt. I'm gonna start smelting metal again soon. So many barrels here? Crazy. There are a lot of barrels in this area. There's potatoes for growth. Whoa, wait a second. There's light coming from there. Oh, hold on. Alright, hard to port. Port. Wait a second. Looks like there's one of those big old guys up there. So let's just kind of get near it, and then we can go and start building. Let's get some big, big item building here. So I can't build any more collectors right now. We need to just slowly start gathering all of the palm leaves that we can. Turn those fronds into ropes and the like. We're going to get some work done here. We want to get some balls. Let's see how these things look. I don't know if we want to go with that or standard walls, that walls. I kind of want to go with the solid walls. They look cool, but I guess they go with the solid foundation. So 
I guess it's not worth us really paying much attention to right now. We'll just have a open floor plan for a little bit. We'll go ahead and we'll move all of our cooking stuff into uh, into the galley setup soon. All right, let's go hard to port here. Should have moved over a little earlier. Oh man, too long. What do we got in the meantime? A chair. Hey. Oh, quick. The anchor. Where the anchor? Chair and a cactus. Okay. We're running out of space for food in here, unfortunately. Let's just take the beads out. Food in there. We have too many potatoes. We have too many potatoes, which is an amazing thing. I'm very happy with us having too many potatoes. But uh, we're going to have to get that sorted. You off. I'll drop the beats off in here. Okay. Uh, go with the wood ones. The palm walls. Take palm leaves. You need them for nests. Oh, we've got one nest already. It prepped and ready. Um, Alright, so let's take a look here. So, we can make some bottles. We don't have, we don't have infinite plastic right now. That's the thing we're limited on. Oh, that's where we can use our stones. Stone arrows, okay. Let's go ahead and let's make ourselves a basic bow. Figure out our the spread to go. And arrows just require some stone, which we've got plenty. Plastic. Well, I don't want to look too gung ho with that. That's okay. So, assuming the arrows don't have to be in inventory, but we'll leave them here in the last slot so we can see how many we have. Uh, how do we want to do this? We've got build, we've got water, we've got axe. Realistically, it should be here. That should be. Nice. Alright, uh, what else do we want to do before we leave? Actually, we got rid of all the seaweed, so we actually can't make that. I was thinking there's nothing we actually need basic seaweed for, but we do, actually. Yeah. There, we're not going to do any decorations quite yet. Is there anything else we need to build before we go? Uh, we don't need a new one. <laughs> Gone through all of our plastic. I got a little too gung ho with the with the arrows. I didn't realize it was six for six. Well, that's okay. So it goes. Off wood and crumbs. I'll even drop off the loop here. I don't need to carry loop with us at all anymore. Uh, that was the last of the goop that we can make for now. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's get metal going. Uh, we're low on copper, so let's get some copper. Right. Got anything you can research? Mm, true, good question. Water. Fill that up. Fill ourselves up with water. Oh, I just drank seawater. What am I doing? It's okay. Four and five. Okay, good. Air potatoes. Planks. Right, 
research table. Uh, jar, feathers, dirt, explosive stuff, titanium, feathers, eggs, honey, leather, wool, eggs, leather, wool, leather, wool, leather, wool. No, there's nothing else we can research right now. I don't know what to do with these blueprints. Maybe we stick them on a wall or something. We'll have to figure that out later. Got everything we need. I would very much like to get closer to land. I thought there was going to be some, like, coral reef down here, but no. Not at all. We did stop here mostly because of the shark. So let's get closer to land. Closer to everything here. So check that out. Dishes. It's a boar. Nice. Okay, we're gonna take out that boar. Never know what hit him. Let's go to forward. Throw the anchor. This is a good spot here. <laughs> the anchor's on, like, the highest point there is. It's funny. Anything good in here for us? A bunch of scrap. Which is good. We are low on scrap. I want to do stuff in the water while we're still waiting on the shark to respawn. You can also plant beets. Get tons of potatoes. Yeah, we got tons of potatoes, but we can always get more taters. Yeah, what we'll end up doing is I want to get a handful of farm plots so that we've got one farm plot making beets, one farm plot making potatoes, uh, one doing uh, pineapple, one doing melons, and one doing whatever tree we're doing. I want to have like a full spread. Wow, look at all the fish. And a big fish. That actually looks like an, like an interactable fish. I don't know if it's going to kill us. Yep. Oh, yeah. Got scary googly eyes. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a pokey fish. I hit him twice. Okay, it says pick up. Oh, pick up. Achievement unlocked. Kill one poison puffer. Explosive goo and a poison puffer head. Holy moly. Okay. Nice. So now we know that there's dangers other than just sharks. Scary. The happy fish. Such a goofy base fish. Open crate. Whoa! Hinges glass. Nice. Scrap. Like all that. Get air first here. If we can make explosive stuff now. That's good. Let's grab all the uh, seaweed here we missed. Oh, we can hang on the walls a trophy? Nice. Seaweed. It's, we don't have enough air down here. We should get an air uh, bottle soon. Be nice to have. Also, we're gonna need a new one of these. Our spear's nearly done. Down here, grab this metal. We don't need more metal, but I want more metal. Since it's used for all of our upgraded tools, kind of just always require metal. Alright, with all the seaweed, we'll have plenty of goop, and we'll also be able to make flippers again, because I totally forgot that we need seaweed to make flippers. Nice little coral space here, though. Coral reef. 
Alright, is there anything else that is catching our eye? So we swim through here, other than all the scrap. I mean, the scrap's nice, but again, it's not required. We don't have to have it. It's a nice to have. We already still have, we still have a stack of scrap lying around. We still get some while we're out and about. Picking up barrels and the like. Looks like that is it. Get back to the raft. Get back to the ship. Ow. I was wondering where he went. Couldn't find him. Back to the ship. Hey, it works! Chew my lock. Kill one bird. Uh, beginner bird hunter. Feathers. Feathers. Raw drumstick. Drumstick and arrows. Oh, nice. We get our arrow back. Perfect. All right. Learning, learning, learning. Research feather. So now we can make metal arrows. We can make a hammock. We can make a paintbrush. Very nice. Wait, we got plenty of scrap action. I didn't realize how much we had. Oh! Uh, Ow! Um. Okay, I need to know before anything else. Does that do damage to the ship? Can that break the ship? Can that break the ship? Angered the bird god? Oh no! <laughs> it doesn't break the ship? Oh, thank goodness. Okay. I was really worried. I thought we were going to be in a lot of trouble there. How's it going, Sam Deadlock? Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? First time seeing your stream? You like the YouTube VODs? Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. What YouTube VODs have you been watching? Which series? Which series have you been watching of late? The ones that have been uploading recently have been, what, uh, The Witcher 3? Uh, Conan Exiles? And State of Decay 2? That's been recently being uploaded. More Conan Exiles being released in under 12 hours. The Conan ones? Nice. I love Conan. The next episode is released in 11 hours. 30 minutes. Oh, 32 minutes. Like that. Yeah, we're actually in a lot of trouble here. I have to keep my head up. Uh, if he does it one more time, we're actually dead. That's, that's actually really bad. <laughs> yeah, we're about to die here. And we've already lost like a bunch of our gear already because of that. We, we need to be very careful here. Um, so he's out of the... No, there he is. I was going to say he's out of the sky, so we need to pay most, most attention to him. There's a goop. We'll just put that in here for now. Weed, it's fine. Metal chest. You just mind your business over there, Mister. Oh, great, thanks. Bring in more metal. We're down to only seven metal left. Copper. Metal's gonna be used for re. Replenishing all of our gear. Oh! I don't have any plastic? Oh, gee, that's not good. Oh. Uh-oh. Shark, no! Don't do that. Oh, I think we're dead. Run! Don't stop moving. Okay. We're... <laughs> We get attacked if we're in the water. We get attacked if we're out of the water. This is bad. <laughs> this this isn't going well at all. That's okay. We've got a plan. Drumsticks. We're going to eat the chicken and we're going to... Oh, man. Those drumsticks look good. We're going to eat the chicken and we're going to eat the uh, the shark. Everything should be a-okay. -okay. Wind is pushing us this way. We can get away from the island for a bit, but coming back is going to be tough. Put this in here. Oh, that's right, we have another small storage. Perfect. 
Put this here for now. Nice. Now the birds are trying to kill you? Yeah, the birds are trying to murder me now. I'm kind of just hoping my health will uh, come back on its own. Drumsticks are really good. Mm. Delicious. Potatoes. Put those potatoes. Get our food up and running here. All right. Nice, nice. I kind of want to like do other things, but I'm too worried about this bird now. <laughs> this this bird's made me too anxious. Hit him. How about now? Back off, you. Go roost somewhere. A little puff of feathers from him. Right. Not just waste our arrows randomly. Cost a lot of plastic. All right, so we're gonna have to go jump on on main land here, unfortunately. Hey, Beth, kind of, sort of. Thanks for the follow. Welcome. Good to have you here. Oh, actually, we can grab this one. It's extra seaweed. Oh, <laughs> I keep falling in that hole. Cannot wait till I fill that thing. I have a lot easier. Right, we have enough health that we can take one hit from the rock. So let's keep an ear out for when it calls. When it gives a cry. That'll be the easiest way to tell when it's coming our way. All right, let's get back in focus. Oh, not done cooking. Please, please keep cooking. Let's focus on what we're doing here. So, what I want to do is move things around to the back. So I'm thinking having a door going in the back would be kind of nice, but we can't center it. So that's unfortunate, but that's okay. Um, we can technically walk through this space. We could have a door here. But what's more important is we move these. All right. So we're going to have a galley back here. I don't know how close the wall has to be. We're just going to assume here. Okay. Oh, that's battery. Here. Perfect. Box. Oh my god, it's amazing. Alright. There we go. Enjoy lurking in your streams. Cool chill streamers. Hard to find these days. Really? Well, I appreciate you hanging out. Hide under ledges? Yeah, that makes sense. So, okay, so actually, that means that if we have an indoor space built, we should be A-OK -okay then, right? So for now, I'll just chuck all these smoothie recipes here. It's the same recipe, but why not? All right. You shoot it when it comes near you with a rock, then run when rocks fall on you. It takes some... Oh. Hey. No. That worked. <laughs> but now we need a new one. Alright, what do we need for a new one of these suckers? Also, what is this? Ingot and feathers. Okay, that's not too bad. Alright, two things of metal and a bunch of rope. We got plenty. Need the metal. Three metal for that. Yeah, we're gonna have to start cooking metal. Like a lot of it. Okay, so while we're still doing stuff here, we're going all in on metal production. Oh! I saw the shadow, but I wasn't fast enough. So the cry actually doesn't happen with enough time for me. Looks like you pulled it out of inventory, or out of the chest instead of out of inventory. Interesting. Okay. We've got this set up. Get a little cooker here, too, just. Thematically. Thematically, so we'll just put you there. 
Uh, the grill is what we need to move over there next. Okay. Here for now. Alright, so let's go ahead and move the grill. Well, the grill is going to go right here. We got all of our, we'll have our smoothie stuff in here. Not smoothie stuff in here. Have our meats. Right direction. Yeah. Mm. I am currently making my base look pretty. Stop it. <laughs> you absolute monster. Actually, don't know. I'm assuming watermelons will eventually be used for the smoothies as well, just a different recipe. So we'll go ahead and put this into the research. Okay, so we've got food in there, and then eventually we'll want one for, like, food that's already cooked. Now, we might actually want a second water purifier, to be honest. One in the kitchen, and one out by the farm space, which is going to be here. Probably going to want both. Can I actually put these behind? They still fit. The... Oh, I measured off of where this was. I can actually put this way further back. Or scoot it way up. No, way further back is where it's No! Okay, now we're in trouble. Alright, we're gonna back off. We're gonna back off. Go this way. We can come back to the island in a bit. Let's back off and heal. I'm trying to get some stuff done over here, my man. Well, that's not good. Right? We're just gonna just back straight off. Oh my goodness. You can shoot it when it comes near you uh, with rock, then run when rock falls. It takes some um, rock arrows, less when using like, metal arrows. That makes sense, because just more damage than metal arrows. Alright, let's just, let's just back off. Let's just back off for a moment. So it doesn't keep harassing us here. I want to finish organizing how we're going to make the house. This is important. I think I am gonna do it this way, where we have the flat metal on the inside, or the flat side, flat boards on the inside, reinforcements on the outside. I think we are gonna do it this way. We still have a shark here. Just because the bird's not around doesn't mean we're safe. Hey, you. It's getting harder and harder to hear where he is. Yeah, so if we go ahead and... Build it like so. This can hang on walls, so it can fire. Oh, interesting. Yeah, we're gonna back everything up here. The minute I've actually put in collectors on this line here, and going back one further, lining this out with another triangle. Do you have any spare planks, or are we all out? I still have planks. Or plastic, but that's okay. Here we go. All right. Let's go ahead and let's reorganize this. I'm going to be low on uh, metals for a minute. 
or er, low on wood for a minute. Means we're going to be struggling with producing more metal. That's okay. I'm going to finish setting this. I should set you here. Oh, this is gonna be, oh, this is perfect. Oh, this, is, this is perfect. Check this. This is absolutely perfect. There are recipes here for now. Okay. Grab you. Oh my goodness, you're not... Oh, no way. That's awesome. <laughs> That's so cool. Okay. I did not see that coming. That's huge. I know you said you can hang them on walls. I didn't realize it was going to actually, like, put in a different sprite that actually has, like, wall mounting on it. That's so cool. That's such a nice touch. That is such a nice touch. I might actually leave it like this. A little space. Such a nice touch. Uh, almost anything can be on walls. Interesting, okay. Organized. And you here for more of just a thematic reason. We can put you on a table. set you there for now. We might end up throwing that out, I don't know. Wait, this too? Wait, what? No! That's insane! It's got an entirely different sprite! Oh, I absolutely love this. Okay, we're gonna leave this up front. We're gonna leave that up front. We're gonna leave that up front. We're gonna have um, that in the bedroom. We're gonna have a little a little stove in the bedroom. We've got the galley in the back. We're gonna have a stove in the bedroom. Perfect. That is amazing. I like that a lot. That's really cool. Alright, we're gonna leave this as it is currently set up. However, there's much, much more that needs to happen to get this galley finished. We need to get a table in here. This of course is gonna have the um, we're gonna have to get the walls set up to enclose this area. We're probably gonna have the walls go to actually we might actually scoop this in and make it just big enough to enclose this. A three by bunch because I want a lot of space for growing so we might make this a short squat space I was originally thinking of going one further out to here but then that gives us what one two three four five only Ooh. only gives us five slots for growing I don't know how big those slots are going to require I'm not sure on that one all right our health is full let's get our water and hunger to full and let's go check the island we've done enough of our Reorganizing and building over here. That uh, it is time. Oh, jeez. Okay. It's time for us to go and do some exploration. That's metals. We're all out of wood though, so definitely have to go land. All right, that should be enough metal for now. Back off you. Pineapple and watermelon plots are big. Yeah, that was my assumption was they were going to be on the large size. Large side. Um, so I was worried about that. Stone off. Up up them potatoes. I don't have any planks to actually burn it. Weird. this at least. We don't have any planks for cooking right now. We've gone through all of them. I think we need two planks to cook all of our... Oh, perfect. Can we get a long shot here? Oh. Oh my goodness. The triple. Alright. Review. You. Perfect. Beaten potato plants. Can also be mounted on the walls? No. 
Are you serious? Oh, that's so cool. All right, we'll definitely get those set up. We might have... Oh, that... Yes! Okay. Yes. What we're going to do is we're going to have a little cook stove in the bedroom with a little plot for beets or potatoes on the wall. Oh, this could be so good. So if we need a little midnight snack, we can just cook ourselves up a quick little potato, right? Oh my goodness, I love it. We can we can drift off to sleep to the smell of mashed potatoes, right? Good old potatoes. This guy, that guy there. Right now, all of our stockpile of food is just potatoes. Ugh. In the ceiling, but you'll need to be half high. Oh, interesting. Yeah, we can play with that. Greetings and salutations. How are you doing, Stormy Snow? Building a floating mansion yet? That's what we're currently working on. We're building the galley. We're building the, the ship's galley right now. But, uh, of course, we're out of wood again. So we're going to need to go hit landfall. What does T do, by the way? I've been seeing it down here this whole time. All right. You're a forward scout. Your raft is your home. Your hook is your friend, too. If your raft breaks, you patch it up. If your hook's, hook is lost, make another. Three. If you find a big blue stretch out forever, that means you aren't paying attention. Okay. There's nothing you can't make if you have the right salvage. Follow the radio frequencies. If it's still broadcasting, it's above water. That eh, makes sense. Um, others have come before you. More will come after you. Be sure to mark the way. Okay. The world is gone, but the story remains. Gather as many as you can. And for Pete's sake, watch out for sharks. Nice. Right. I was curious about what that button was. I thought it was like a, a wiki page, but uh, it is not. All right. Oh, wrong way. Um, you'll attempt to learn how to sail between the islands blindfolded. I mean, may we'll we'll have to, we can, but we have to do it by braille. We have to sail by braille if we're doing that. All right, let's head in. We might not actually put a door on this. We might just have this be an. We might have this just be an enclosed shelter. I think that's what I want to do. Have this be an enclosed shelter. Actually, what we could do. Ooh. What we could do is we could have uh, double stairs. One stair going. One stair here, one stair here going up. So that we get into the galley this way. But it's still open enough that you can just run over here and hit. Hit that. Because it's the wall. I think we can put... Yeah, we can put that there. Even with that, we can still get in close enough to interact. My anchor real quick, sorry. Whoop! Oh. Did you get a roof soon? That sunburn's not looking good? Yeah, it's a pretty bad sunburn. We'll get it going soon. Bad shark. I would. Zero planks. We're gonna have to go and get some on shore here. Closer, a little closer, a little closer. Drop anchor. Place the sail. Land we go. What is this? No one mentioned you could buy stuff. You can buy stuff. Plastic. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> we got cover. Uh, tier 1, Tier 2, Tier 3. Reputation. 0, 300. Sell. Oh! Oh, 
Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Look at all these fish. Listen to this music. Heck. We have simple bait. Requires a trash cube. Trash cube? Trash cube and trade coin. Coin for chilies, turmeric. Recipe for catfish deluxe. Oh my goodness. Makes you run faster. Red beet shot. Extra health. Holy moly. An air horn. Who oh, know your friends? I like it. A wardrobe. Gonna need that. Compass. Would be convenient. Tier 2. You can get ores. Advanced baits. A reputation for that. Ash cubes. Oh my goodness. We are missing out on a lot of stuff. Wow. Even larger crop. Lots. Okay. Chef's hat. Oh my goodness, we need that. I wouldn't say this hat either, or. Advanced Scarecrow. Bridge stores food and anything else. Longboard bridge. Long draw bridge, sorry. Surfboard. Somebody got unlucky. Must have got a bite in it. Reading post cassette so we can listen to music. I like it. Fishing hat. Lures for any occasion. This is really cool. Oh my goodness, there's a pirate hat. Oh, we're gonna need that pirate hat. We get really high up there. Right, we're gonna have to figure out how to get these fish. We haven't, I haven't seen any of these before. Oh, it's dark. Oh, I ran. Pick up my ears if I miss. Where are you? Happy goat. I need leather. Oh, I really don't want to miss because we lose plastic. Come on back, happy ram. Out. How much damage does this thing gonna take? These things are monsters. Gotta be careful about getting uh, dropped on again. You can't kill that? Oh, okay. Well, that explains why it's taking just tanking absolutely ridiculous number of hits. We can't kill that ram? Okay. Let's get. Oh, actually, we might just die here if it drops another rock on us. That was a catchable animal. Ah, okay. No! Yeah, I can't dodge it. I don't have any water in me. Drink! Drink, because our life literally... Oh, we're dead. Shark. I fell into the hole. <laughs> that sucks so much. Oh, that hole needs to get sorted. That hole needs to get sorted. Luckily, we didn't lose too many things. This guy is an absolute pain in my butt. Yeah, that shark was ready for us. I fell right there. Oh, man. It'll give you water. Okay, this guy is an absolute pain. Uh, we don't have the plastic that I need. We might have to leave. We're just not in a position to be able to fight this guy. Now we need, now we need to go and get more materials. That's fine. I want to come back here, though. back. Yeah, it looks like we didn't really lose anything too important. We lost, you know, stuff in the inventory, but or, that was mostly like, what, leaves? Leaves and the like. There's more than durability, that kind of sucks. Uh, what do we need for arrows? Plastic. I just don't have plastic. Plastic. 
Ah, oh, it's so silly. I fell into the water. I gotta get this sorted. Nope. Alright, we're almost dead. Again. We gotta go. We're out. We're gone. We're gone. Way the anchor. We're out of here. We got to see a thing. We got to go and set up some cool, like, check out some cool stuff. We're gone. Just gonna have to watch the sky. We gotta go. This bird has uh, kicked us off the island for now. But we'll be back with a vengeance. I will let you know. Oh, uh oh. Uh oh, he doesn't like my threat. Start off standing here. I was hoping I could get him to stop. Gotta hammer him now. I was hoping if I hit him that would make him stop, but uh, I don't know. Alright. We just need to get a whole bunch of collections down here, and then we can run along this area without any issue. But for right now, it is dangerous. Decorations, you say? Also, stuff lets us repair. That's good. Need to get some repairs done. Have to get the wood too. Not the only island with a bird. Yeah, no, we saw a bird on a different island. But we'll be back. We'll start taking out these birds. So we'll figure out how to fight these rocks. Bunch of bunch of barrels. This way, if we can. Oh, so close. Let's plant some there. Get that cooking. Decoration. What do we got? A brand new. Oh, hibiscus. Oh, oh nice. Off. Rocks off. Oh, we whipped it. I think close enough. Can I get him? Nope. Okay. There goes that opportunity. Let's just, uh, Sure, we'll find this island again. Goodle around. How many hours have you played a raft? This is day two. This is day two. Welcome. We're still learning. We've died a couple of times. Mostly to overconfidence. <laughs> Alright, what do we need to do to go and make ourselves more of these collection nets? A bunch of rope. Yeah, we just need to get... Okay, let's try and get into this uh, debris field over here. This solid debris field, then start moving along. Food is at least sorted. I'm not struggling on food. But I would like to go and get bigger, some bigger fish. Stop you. Happy to eat him too. This looks important. We need a lot of it. Forward now. Now we're in the thick of the debris field here. What do we need for another one? Two ropes and a bolt. Oops. Back online. Oh, okay. That debris field was uh, very thin. It wasn't as much as I was hoping. Here. Here. Alright, let's 
Let's go do some fishing while we just move on forward. Actually, we should get some food going first. Let's get another round of potatoes. Another round of potatoes, then we'll get some fish going. All right, perfect. Going into a new free field. Perfect, that's what we're looking for. Potatoes. Water. Pop ourselves off with fresh water while we're at it. Then off. Let's get potatoes. This should be there. We are right on time. Okay. Not a fish. We're getting ourselves some big fish here. That's uh, not a big fish. <laughs> Come on now, let's get some big fish. Some salmons. Ooh, let's go grab that real quick. Palm fronds there. Let me get those palm leaves. Ah, there's that salmon, just as I was asking. Perfect. Nabbed it. All right. Uh, salmon. We will cook the salmon immediately. Just to completely top ourselves off. It's extra wood. I don't know if I can grab, grab that one. Can I? Oh, if I was actually fast enough pulling it back, I could have. Yeah, okay, I'll just grab this one. Check these, make sure they're not overflowing. Nice. Very nice. Very nice indeed. We are collected quite a bit here. Again, we need a lot of plastic. The nice fishing run does have a boost for bigger fish. That's good. I have to figure out baits at some point. That's probably something we have to deal with, like, dirt and whatnot for the first one, and then maybe, like, material or something for, like, the particular lures. But for now, let's just fo focus on getting the big fish. Oh, yeah. The salmon. Now we're talking. Ah, you have to buy the baits. Good, okay. That is good to know. Pick up. Lop you up on every fish so far, okay. Take a chunk of the ship? Yeah, he did. Actually, an important chunk of the ship. <laughs> the one that ensures their stability, just in case that one gets broken over there. If these two break, we're in trouble. Alright. Let us look at more capture nets. Perfect. Filling the space out with more capture nets so that no matter which direction we're going and how much we're actually paying attention, right? Because eventually it's going to get to the point where we're going to be busy with doing a lot of the stuff, I imagine, in the house. And these guys will fill up. And I think it's only... I'm assuming, again, that they only collect up to 10. That'll be good, because then if they slip through one, they'll get picked up by the other. 
get that salmon. Top ourselves off on water as well. All right. Let's drop those off. I've got the tilapia, mackerel, salmon in here. You're used for shark baits. We'll leave you in here. Let's try and get up there with our material. It's very nice. And the scrap. Okay. Got spare scrap. Go. Craft another one. Keep at him. And we'll be in great shape once we can just we don't don't worry what direction we're sailing in. We'll just collect stuff. Thank you. Oh, what the <laughs> don't raise my head up. Wait, we've been here before. Uh, so busy just working on everything else. Pick my head up. Like, wait a second. We've been here before. This is where the other bird was. I wonder if the trees respawned. It would be great to go get more wood and palm. Towards shore here. Take a look. And. Stop. Right back up this way. chest. First our potatoes. We plant the potatoes. Put myself off with water. Alright, then we can go do landfall. Our food for the potatoes. So one, two, three, four. Grab anything that's still in the collectors. Nice. Those off. Go ahead and keep the mackerel, and we'll keep the floppy on hand for while we're on land. This rope does not need to be carried. Stack this, we'll half stack that. Right through them. Uh, what we need are arrows, actually. Two sets of arrows. Make three sets of arrows. I'm crazy. Go wild, yeah? Love it. Get off, you. Come on now. Yeah. Perfect. All right, so we got the spare arrows. Let's go ahead and top ourselves off of the water again. We'll keep a thing of fresh water in our pocket this time. I'm worried about the durability here. The axe is definitely not going to make it, so let's make another axe. Oops. <laughs> throw that. Don't throw that. I need that. Let's make another axe. I guess we can mind. Do one quick circuit on the low end. Let's see. Yeah, that goat's capturable. Hmm, that sounds really cool. We're gonna have to. The ship's gonna have to get way bigger than it currently is. If we're gonna also gonna have animals. 
I didn't, uh, I didn't account for the ship design for animals. Hmm. <laughs> How's it going, Almighty Knight? How are you doing today? Yar, the CB foamy is. Yeah, now the design that I'm going with here, which once we get the back and the front set up, is bedroom, kitchen, farm plot space, navigation spot, and... What's on the top back? I guess, I guess up top could be animals. On the aft deck? I guess we could do that on the aft deck. I'm trying to think what else was going to go there. I don't know. Let's we'll see. But, when we went up this way last time, we ran into a boar, and that's what killed us last time. This time, it won't be so lucky. also that bird thing. You only have 18 shots. I don't know how many shots it's going to take to take out the boar. I'm assuming five, maybe six. Oh, there's another uh, trades post, it looks like, up at the top. That's what those are. There he is. Oh, wait, I couldn't dodge that? Really? Uh-oh. How, how are you supposed to dodge this guy? Okay, I guess like that. Okay. Oh! <laughs> oh, I got caught on something. Rock. How many shots does this thing take? Oh my good gracious! <laughs> Team unlock beginner warthog hunter. It's a warthog. Don't drop that on me. Oh my goodness, jeez! Dodge, dodge like a meteor, apparently. Got most of our arrows back. I'm just missing three that I, I whiffed my shots on. All right, good. That was really good. That could have gone way worse. Oh, more rocks. We got way, way worse. Is there anything else up here for me, or is it just a piggy? Oh no. Turn back. Keep on climbing. Keep on climbing. Yep. I'm gonna go explore this way. I think that's the right direction, but going this way. Oh, like a matador. Sorry. That's like a, like a matador. Yes. Warthog. I thought it was a wild boar. Ah, I was wrong. Berries. Accidentally found red berries. You can eat them. But there's a good use for them, though. This is the dead end. It felt like this was going to be the wrong way. Head up the other direction. It's a Pumba. It is. And he's gonna be delicious. <laughs> Massive flank steak. Ooh, only two pieces. Warthog head. Ooh, trophy. We're gonna have to find a spot to put that up as a trophy. So how many shots did that take, by the way? I think it was like eight shots to kill him. That's tough. We're gonna need to get metal arrows. Jeez, that guy's just dive bombing next to us. Not picking up rocks. Heads up, here we go. Oh. Ladders. Look for the drop before we start doing anything else. The apple thing. More berries. Please don't break, I need that. Bolts! Decorative pack? Oh my goodness. Huge. We sell the same stuff. 
Looks like you do. Yeah, same stuff. Trash cubes. I have to figure out how trash cubes work. I have to check out that spot up there. Oh, what do I need for an axe? Um, stones and rope. I can make a rope, but I need stones. No stones up here, unfortunate. What do we get? We got a brand new... Another chair! Oh my goodness, I'm loving it. Can't wait to start putting in all the furniture. We're getting close. We're getting real close. I heard something else. Oh. Yep, that's what I heard. Wait a second. My ears are tingling. I can keep getting the berries. Person is kind of it. We're just getting a little thin. Huh. Cool antenna on here. Fine cute and addictive. Okay. Can't take full advantage of all the wood here. Unfortunate. Very much would like to if we could. What do we got? A trash can! Hey, that could be useful. Uh, you make a trash cubes from a bench you unlock in the story. Ah, okay. So until we start working on the story. Because right now we're just doing survival. We haven't actually started on any story stuff yet. I think I need to make that antenna. Which I think we might actually have the materials to start making it now. Can I kill this bird? Is that bird murderable? Or is it only a capture bird? Can I eat? Can I eat it? Yes? Oh my goodness, it's so adorable and cute, but I must eat it. Actually, we don't have the inventory space for it, do we? Oh! Ow. Ow. Bonk. Uh, let's head on home. Our inventory is too full. If it drops some more things than just feathers, look at our ship. I'm pretty sure we can just climb down the side. I don't know if there is actual fall damage. There might be. We have too little health now to actually attempt any real trials of fall damage. can do some light fall damage trials, but, uh, yeah, I'd like to capture the little chicken. It's very cute. Oh, no. Stuck there for a second. Hit the mountain, you can go down. They just fly down. Gotcha. Yeah, let's get all that wood out there. berries yet. I'm going to stash them in here for now. Get the rest. Let's crank up. Show you. Oh! Huge! Intermediate shark hunter kill ten sharks. Dun dun dun. Huge. Are rare, save them. I have them right here to be used in the uh, mixer because my assumption is in a smoothie. That is my assumption. Could be right, could be wrong. I don't know. That's the assumption. 
Oh yeah, also potatoes. We have 60 potatoes. I have a few, fair few. Then the cook pot, okay, perfect. Then it's exactly where it needs to be. Two bolts. Ooh. Yes. A leather. No, I'm not a normal I guess with the leather here. I don't know where else to put it. Do here. Is this in the kitchen? I can't put it anywhere. Can I wear it? Yep. Nope. Nope, don't need that. Alright, it's a trophy. Maybe we need to get like an item that lets us uh, put that on a trophy on a stick or something. Not much reef around here. There's some down there. Yeah, we need more wood and stuff than anything else. Let's go ahead and take the head. And with the rest. Salt water. That's. Don't forget to research things like leather. Ah, oh, yes, that's right. We just got the leather. We should research that. That's something we do need to research. Didn't unlock anything for us. We still need wool, it looks like. Titanium. It's now unlocked. But yeah, explosive. The explosive goo. Not a researchable thing. Okay. Hmm. No surprise. Alright, let's go ahead and make a new axe. We do need a new axe. Four rope and bolt. That's convenient. Actually, let's go ahead and get another one of these, can't we? Do any nails still? Nails. Another one down. We need what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven more, and we're done. We're close. Smelt the goo first, then try researching. Oh, I never would have tried smelting the goo. I'm going to be honest. I literally never would have tried. Never, never crossed my mind. That's, I will take that tip. Thank you very much. Water. We're getting low on planks, so I don't really want to be smelting too much right now. Because we are getting very, very low on them. We've got 20 left on hand. But otherwise, we're darn near out. Um... I'm working at fronds. We can do one more. We can do one more here. Just more that we can walk on. Let's finish building up the front. Walk this. Fail. This hammock's gonna be great once we get this thing online. We need more feathers, though. More than that. Don't think explosives sounds like. Um, yeah, it's like you're gonna blow it up. Yeah. I know, right? Well, that's why I wasn't thinking of doing that. But yeah, I guess that makes sense. You're not actually. You're not actually smelting it, you're just dehydrating it, right? You're probably just dehydrating it, is what it is. Net canister. We need more explosive powder, rocks. Okay, so it's like an explosive bola. Is what I'm getting. Well, it's a net. We're gonna need that to capture animals. It's gonna be good. Okay, perfect. Vicious smidgen. We can get a couple other big fish here that'd be big. Be good for us. Stockpile of smidgen. Oh, mackerel. It's a decent size. We need herrings, though, so we can make some more shark bait. That'd be good. Hmm. 
Yeah, so really... Oh my goodness, Sam. Oh, big shark's back. Uh, so really, we just need to get those last bit of collectors finished. And then we can start finishing up the the backspace where we have our uh, galley. And then once we get the galley done over here, we can then put stairs up and get the top going. We'll probably like move the research table, I think, up there. Maybe, maybe we put the antenna and the, the radio up there, too. Maybe that's where we could... Ah, oh, there's Aaron. Maybe we put that up there. Have that be like research development tracking. Everything goes up there, maybe. And then... Yeah, because we're going to put the sail in the front. No, if we're going to put the sail in the front... Yeah, no, then we can just put the sail in the front. That makes sense. Okay, yeah, we can do that. That'll work. We just need so much wood. We're gonna need a lot. <laughs> hey, Herman Raptor. Thank you for the follow. Welcome. A Raptor. I appreciate you hanging out. Hopefully, you're having fun. This should be the last fish before this thing breaks. I really like how our ship's coming along, but our ship now feels too small. Like, it's amazing. It's, oh, basically one more. It's amazing. At first I was like, oh, our ship's a decent size. And then it's like, okay, we need more space. And now we have these crafting stations and build it up with this anchor, and I'm like, okay, now it's a decent size. And now I'm looking at the, the things that we're going to be doing, like the stuff that needs to get done, and I'm like, our ship isn't even close. We need way more space. I think we need a bigger box. We need a bigger box. We don't have a spare. What do we need for a normal chest? Or rope. Oh, we actually don't have enough. Only one hinge. We need five of these suckers. Any palms anywhere? Yeah, we can really use a new chest. That's ah, alright. Sort that one in. Finally getting through some rocks. Goodness. I'll throw your trash in here instead of the ocean. It's a hinge. I imagine it's just like throw stuff out and it's gone forever. I don't know if I really want a trash can yet. Although a trash can would be thematic. Yeah, let's, get, let's build a trash can. Why not? Let's build a trash can. Right here. Nice. Put it in the kitchen, right? And I'm kitchen scraps and the light can go there. Food. I forgot to... So focused on this, I forgot to actually do some cooking. Get the catfish going, though. Mackerel in here. These two go for bait. I guess we can take the... It's out. We can sort out inventory for... a. Uh... Or a new chest another time. It's not too urgent for us to get that. It's fine. It's here. Oh no! Yeah, it's not like coming. Not fast enough. Grab two plastic and get that fixed. Too hungry. This is why I want to make sure we have like spare food on hand at all times, as opposed to waiting until we get this hungry. So I want to, I want to get a, like a cooked food chest and a regular like you know ingredients chest. So it's currently raining. I don't actually put the water in there. 
But we're gonna need to get a cooked food chest just so this doesn't happen anymore. Just so that anytime we're hungry, we already have food gripped. Make life nice and easy. Speaking of which, actually, there's no space in here for these potatoes. Okay, we'll, we'll put these potatoes in the seed chest. Eventually, we'll get some big plots going. We'll, we might end up losing all these potatoes, who knows. Alright, it's all cooked. Done and done. One, two... Perfect. Let's go ahead and get three potatoes going, too. That's good. Get the three potatoes, so we have more inventory space for potatoes. Yeah? And we'll leave this. Actually, something we could do is we could just leave food pre-cooked on the grill and just always have that ready until we get the fridge or chest specifically designated for finished foods. Might be what we need to do for now. Alright, so we've managed to get everything set back up inventory-wise. We are going to need to get a new weapon, new spear sin, which is fine. How are we doing on metal? We're doing okay. Yeah, planks are really what we need. We need planks and palm. That's just the same, same old, same old, huh? Not really much else on the island. We could go back up there and cut down the trees, or we could just go right back out to the ocean. A whole bunch right there, a whole bunch of debris right there. Uh, but that's gonna have to be next time. Have to be next time. Go ahead and save and head back to the main menu. So thanks for hanging out, everyone. It's been a blast. I'm really enjoying this game. I'm having a lot of fun. Oh my goodness, I see this and I'm like, yeah, we're gonna have to go crazy with decorating. Look at this raft. It looks amazing. He actually has railings. We don't even have railings. Oh. Actually, maybe the railings are a thing. I just completely ignored them on the uh, the build. But oh my goodness, yeah. No, we're definitely going to have to... We have so much work to do. We're going to finish building this up. Just to get it functional. And then we're going to have to start making it look pretty. Just because this raft looks so cool. <laughs> it looks so good. I want to build one like it. But thanks for stopping by and saying hi, everyone. I really appreciate you all hanging out. We'll be playing State of Decay for the next two days. We'll be playing State of Decay then. Uh, when you have time, check out the page, uh, Steam page on Raft. Yeah, I can take a look at that. Uh, but yeah, so tomorrow and the next day will be State of Decay 2. We'll be continuing to play our Heartland playthrough. And then next week, Monday, Tuesday, we'll be right back playing Raft. I think this Saturday we are going to be playing Stardew Valley with Enigmatic Rose, Sky, and the others, uh, who are whoever is free to play, uh, as there's going to be a brand new update to Stardew Valley. So I think we are going to be playing that because it's releasing eight-person multiplayer which is pretty cool. We'll be checking that out. But thanks for stopping by and saying hi, everyone. I really appreciate it. I will see you all tomorrow. Have a good morning, evening, night, wherever you are in the world. I'll see you then. Take care. Bye-bye.